Yo. <sighs> said 20 hours so we've gone um what well, i think we've gone uh fucking four hours and in six hours of driving so that's not bad i mean this thing can only go fucking 45 50 miles an hour so and, and it's pulling a, a fucking trailer too with a car on it so it's pretty bad honestly hold on let me see the audio one sec and everything. I'm gonna, okay. put, I'm gonna put you in the back trunk where Boldasat is, you know? No. If you don't stop no. the shit. <laughs> okay. Actually, I just I'm just kidding. Uh, yo, what's up? That actually brings up a point. If you're wondering where Gray is, he's, uh, well, he didn't, he's not, he didn't come with us. He uh, actually got in touch with him today, and he said uh, he's just going through some stuff, so he was not able to leave California at this time, so... It's just me and Kimberly as we drive to Texas. Fucking ain't that just uh, a thing? All the way to Austin. It's gonna be lonely when I get there, I feel so. Look, you have hearts. No, he didn't ditch. He's uh oh those are your hearts. He didn't oh. ditch. He he just has problems going on right now and he can't really leave California at the moment, so it's not a big deal. It's not like anything he wanted to do or whatever, so. Okay, hopefully this fucking stream doesn't lag when we start driving and go through the fucking desert more. We're at a gas station right now, but let's go. You know, driving this thing is really not hard at all. It's just like, it's just heavy. Like I can't brake for shit and I can't accelerate for shit, but like it's easy to drive. People said driving with a trailer. In, a in 300 back, feet, turn right onto Dome Rock Road West. Would be hard, but it's really not hard at all. And I hope you guys cannot hear the map. Not that it really matters. We're fucking 2,000 miles. West Texas sucks. I, I mean, I, I, I don't know where Take west. the next right onto Dome Rock Road West, <laughs> then turn left at Quartzsite <laughs> Avenue. Hey, that's fine, dude. We're fucking, we're like very far away from Texas, so it's it's fine for now. I don't really care. We're literally going. Take the next left at Quartzsite Avenue, then turn right onto the I-10 East ramp. <laughs> we're literally going down I-10 East <laughs> for literally 1,500 miles, so y'all can know that. I don't care. Uh, West Texas, I don't know where West Texas is, but, I mean, I'm going to Austin, so. Okay, yo, where the fuck does this bitch want me to go? Straight? I can't actually, oh, you know, left. Yeah, okay. Uh, are my headlights on? Those are the wind, windshield wipers on. Oh, no, don't. Don't hold, get those mixed up. Hold up, hold up. Yeah, my lights are on, but they're not very bright. Okay, Turn fuck. right onto the I-10 East ramp. Yeah, shut the fuck up, bitch. All right. We're good. Let me just get on the highway chat, and then uh, I just have to go straight. I actually hate driving at night, especially when the roads don't have any fucking headlights anywhere because uh, or lamps. So I can't. I can't see. In a quarter mile, merge onto I-10 East. Yeah, don't worry, Kimberly. I got you. I'm not gonna kill us. Don't worry. I don't know how long we're gonna drive tonight, chat. We've already been driving for seven hours. I don't know how long we're gonna drive tonight, but probably pretty long. Cause I just want to get there. I don't want to fucking 
bullshit around. I don't want to have to be driving for four days or five days or however long it fucking takes people to get there. I just want to get there. But then again, I do need to sleep. Otherwise, I'm going to fucking pass out and, and kill us. Uh, actually, if you're wondering, I had to get this truck from... Hopefully, it's not too, bump, too bumpy, too. I had to get... Or too loud. How's, how's the... How's the audio, by the way? Is it, like, loud as fuck? Or like... Continue on I-10 East for 137 miles. Only that, yeah, only that bitch is loud. Okay, so... I actually had to fly all the way to Vegas to pick up this truck and then drive it back to L.A. to pack our shit in. And you're probably wondering why. Well, if I wanted to rent a U-Haul or a Penske, and I got Penske because they do not charge the miles, and I cannot believe that. U-Haul charges 40 cents a mile, Penske charges is free, fucking free miles. You can drive as far as you want. And I'm like, that's great. Uh, so that saves me fucking a bunch of money. But... If you rent a fucking moving truck out of California, it's literally four times the price. That a U-Haul would have been almost $4,000 to bring it to Texas. But in Las Vegas, that same U-Haul is $1,500. So I saved literally $3,000 driving from Vegas back to LA, which is, you know, four hours, but I mean, it took me seven hours because this thing's slow as shit. Hard, but, hard, you. It was worth it, so, all good, hey, thank you, dude, I appreciate that very much, fucking, uh, what was that, okay, this could be dangerous, okay, thank, thank you, Joshua, I appreciate that, homie, yeah, ain't that a bitch, I've been driving for days, I haven't slept in for days, I haven't, I've been driving for days, yo, fucking, after the isolation stream, I slept for literally three hours, and then, I started, and then I drove the, and then I flew to Vegas, and drove it back to LA, it fucking, I was so tired, I was dizzy, Halfway through driving that, I got dizzy, and I fucking kept going, dude. I mean, I wasn't that dizzy, but I just felt like shit. I wanted to throw up. I was so tired, and then I just slept on a fucking couch last night, because we packed all our furniture with some viewers last night that came over to the house, and uh, fucking, we just slept on the couch, like, in, in a couch that wasn't ours, and uh, yeah, so that was awful. I didn't get great sleep at all last night. I'm pretty sure the power was turned off too. It was hot as fuck. I was sweating my balls off the whole time. Here's my free super chat for gas. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it. Um, how much gas do you think it's gonna cost driving all the way to Texas? Yo-haw, are you going through El Paso again? Or would you come through Albuquerque possibly for scuffed content? Love from Serial Homie, by the way. I mean, thank you, dude. I mean, if El Paso is... If I 10 pass through El Paso, then yeah. But, uh, I don't know, I'm just going down I-10 to Texas. Fucking motherfucking ass. But I think, uh, yeah, I mean, it's about, uh, 10 miles a gallon. And I can, and there's 500 gallons in it, so... I'm probably gonna spend, like, 400. Somebody said 800, but, like, no, I think it's more along the lines of, like, 400, dude. I'd be fucking surprised if it's more than that. I mean, I didn't even have to fill up the thing at all. I only used half the tank from Vegas... <laughs> Well, shit, from Vegas to, I'm trying to turn my cruise control on. Oh my gosh. From Vegas to LA, I only spent fucking, or I didn't spend any gas. It was only half a tank of gas that, that happened, so that wasn't bad at all. Yeah, I wish Volta had the, the best of luck. I don't know, uh, I mean, I know what problems he's going through. I just, I'm not going to say it on stream because nobody's business. But, you know, it sucks. Whatever. Uh, we're definitely going to, it's going to be interesting to uh, live without him, that's for sure since I've been living with him for almost three years now, so. But it's okay, we got Kimberly, so it's fine. It's fine, you look like you hate your fucking life. It's so bumpy. <laughs> it, it's not that bumpy, it's come on. It's so bumpy. Ow. It's, what do you mean, ow? You don't get... There's a speed trap ahead. Thank you, bitch. It hasn't gotten, uh, you haven't gotten used to it by now? No, I do, and then I forget, and then I remember how bumpy it is. Yo, we had to, uh... And Locks on me. <laughs> yeah, that's. I mean, you just take the seatbelt off. No, I'm gonna die. Yo, let me say, uh, there's a lot of. We, we went by a drug, uh, a drug stop, uh, like an hour ago, and I'm wearing a fucking cocaine shirt. So, I mean, they didn't stop us because I guess we didn't look like we had drugs, but fucking, there was a bunch of police and shit. They would have stopped us. That would have been awkward because, like, obviously, like, they would just give me problems and shit for probably no reason. So. I don't know. It t dude, every hour that we drive this, I think we lose two hours. Like, because you're this is the highway 75, and we can only. Ice. That squeaky's gonna drive you guys insane. 
Go buy some WD-40. Oh, what the fuck does WD-40 do? I only know that from King of the Hill. What the fuck does it do, though? This is like shit to clean your grill, right? Or like oil or something? I don't know. I mean, I think it's fine. I don't need to buy any shit, dude. Fucking, I just need that diesel gas. That's it, homie. Hey, if anyone in the chat wants to uh, come hook us up some diesel gas, fucking stream out the truck, bro. No, I mean, I'm not really just kidding. That'd be cool, but uh, unrealistic, obviously. I'll be your new BFF in Texas, lol. I mean, hey, I could be down for that, but you gotta come say what's up to me. I wonder how many people, if I do an IRL stream, how many people will... I've done this drive six times in my life, homie, and twice with moving trucks. It's going to run six to eight hundred. Tell Kimberly to let those puppies bounce. I mean, she's got a pretty tight bra on, so nothing... Hopefully she comes on streams more. Six hundred dollars for gas won't be too bad. Hold on. So, the Bluetooth in the car... Wow, so Kim kicked out of old sad. Ruined your friendship. Uh, no, that's obviously not what happened. I just said that he said he couldn't leave. Hold his could not leave California right now. He's going through some shit. Hopefully she can stream on streams more. Hey, she or she is for quite a while I'm in the car. Um, I couldn't get the Bluetooth in the car, in the truck to work. I don't know why. It just doesn't fucking work. And I thought it was going to work because I packed all my fucking speakers in the back. So I'm like, fuck, I, I just don't, this shit's not working. So I can only listen to the alerts through the phone, which is fine, but it's, I just wish it was louder. Uh, but there's not even that. The radio has, no, there's no good radio stations. What do you think of it? picking clip. There's only Spanish and country, so I, there's not even, I don't even, I, we haven't had the radio on for six hours, like, it's fucking trash. We just sit here in silence. Uh, when do you think, I won't ever talk about her big butt. What? What do you think about EBC and his booger eating? Um, that's fine. I mean, who cares? Who the fuck doesn't eat their boogers? Like, EBC comes from a place where there's not much food, so you have to get what you can get, and that motherfucking boogers is three calories right there. Like, why would, like, why not? Like, I don't know. Like, if you're starving on an island, you're probably gonna eat your fucking boogers, like... Glad you're coming. Welcome to the great state of Texas. Smile, happy to have you. What part are you coming to? I'm gonna be living in Austin. Now, today was sort of emotional, dude. Or, you know, from so we go reasons. from being too cold to go out and stream in LA to being too hot to go out and stream in Texas. Huh. Great. Believe it or not, I actually like the heat. I'm uh, from Florida, so I love the fucking heat, dude. Like, yeah, if it's 100 degrees in Texas, I love it. Yo. The sun feels good on my fucking skin, and it makes me feel like warm and like a vagina, and I would like that. What's up, dude? Viral moments, what's up, bro? Now, today was a little bit emotional for many reasons. Leaving LA, the, the place he, I've been in for three years, pretty crazy. Like, that shit, it's just, it's like, wow, see you later. This was a great experience, but now it's time to move on. Like, it's just, uh, just an emotional thing. Come make a pit stop in PHX and sleep. Don't drive straight. The end of the I-10 is closed past PHX. Who, uh, if you need anything in Oz? Phoenix is still, like, four hours away. I don't know. I'd Be ready for me to stream Snipe UI make you pee Andy. Uh, okay, QP Andy, thank you, dude. Um, I think if I stop in Phoenix, I'll never get to fucking Texas, so I think I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna drive straight through the Austin, because I'm pretty sure it's a 40 hour drive in a slow ass truck, but I'm probably gonna stop in like New Mexico somewhere, or I'm just gonna go as far as I pop, I, I can before I pass out. Um, but thank you, dude. So, leaving California emotional. Also emotional because I left all my friends. Hold the sad, Kyle. You know, Victor, any fucking else that's there, you know, Gary, seen EBZ for the last time, was like, damn, like, it was just like, leaving everyone just, it's just fucking, like, emotional, like, sure, they can come visit, or I can come visit, but it's just, that's not gonna happen often, so it's, it's, it's weird, and then obviously the most emotional thing was, uh, just Gray not coming, it's very, very, uh, you know. Please pull over and following behind you. No, no, there's nobody behind me. I can't see it, dude. We're in the middle of nowhere in the fucking desert. But, thank you, dude. Um, today, as well, I left. I uh, said bye to Scuff Steve Jobs. He was, uh, I don't know. I've known him for three years, too, so I was a little, uh, just sad, you know. Just, I couldn't get through sad. to you 
on Twitter. Any idea if it's okay to add some clips from your channel on IRL Moments channel? Safe drive, bro. I mean, CX in the chat. As long as you don't put shit that I have in my highlight videos, then you're good. You can highlight whatever you want, just if it's the same exact video that I happen to upload, then I'd have to tell you to remove it. Uh, what are your thoughts after the Nikita talk? I mean, not much different, to be honest. I mean, uh, you know. I mean, obviously, I heard what he was saying, and these are all things that I sort of uh, figured out as well, but, you know, it was definitely an interesting talk, like, he definitely was uh, being a hard ass for sure, but, you know, it's fine. Nikita, you know, has some good things to say for sure. I don't think they really understand the how difficult or easy streaming actually is. But, you know, I'll just let them say whatever they want. Every other point CX was in the chat. The only point I thought that was just weird or, like, not accurate was that they don't really know how streaming is. They said it's the easiest job in the world. And, you know, I mean, it's not that... It's not hard compared to, like, other things. Uh, but it's just... Put the easier. camera so we can see both you and Kim in it. We Kim Knights would like to see our beautiful queen on stream. White you Knights Unite. Have, uh, to do stuff with no guidance, and that's the hard part, the no, you know, just, I don't know, figuring shit out, um, you know, I would love to put her on camera too, but she's, this truck's fucking big, and this, the, the camera can only, it doesn't, it's not that wide, it can't really see much, so, why don't you come sit next to me, maybe? Okay, that's, that's a higher seat and more bumpy, I tried it earlier. Really? But let's go. <laughs> I want to get a fucking speaker. Are you going to eat your corn dog? Oh, I got that for you. Let me see. Somebody donated a media. Since we don't have any fucking music, the radio's dog show. Let's see what he got here. Uh, Sorry, I didn't know that was Mark. Okay. I don't know why I didn't pop up, but I don't fucking drive it, so I'll have to figure that out. In a little bit. I'll try to get that shit working. Oh, that squeaking sound. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Like, we've been listening to it. I've been listening to it for the past two days. I don't know what the squeaking fucking sound is. It, I hate it, and I want it to fuck off. But I, I've looked around for literally an hour, and I just I don't know where it's coming from. I can't pinpoint it because it's just coming from everywhere, dude. Like I want to, I want to say, like I just I don't know. Maybe, like it's not the windshield, but like I don't know what, what the fuck it is, dude. To be honest. Is that a y that's not a yikes. Is it yikes when I say baby? No. I think that's a good thing. I think that's normal. What's what? wrong with baby? What if I called you my little pretzel? <laughs> Your what? Your, my little pretzel. Why would I be a pretzel? I don't know, because like pretzels are soft and like nice, warm and salty. I don't want to be You're warm pretzel. and salty. I don't want to be pretzel. I would say. I don't want to be a pretzel. Okay.
craziest place I had sex. Free homie ice for Kimberly shoot you with llama. Was probably an Uber. Or like I figured some girl in an Uber. Sorry, I shouldn't say that. But that was a long time ago. Um Imagine Kimberly still jealous over Cassandra Lolan not inviting her to the goodbye stream. We invited her. Okay, um, and then the first question was, uh, fuck, what did you, I forgot, let me see. Oh, did I ever run a train with anyone? Yeah. Yeah, I ran a train with the, with a crackhead in Vegas with Ness. Yeah. That's okay, she was clean though, and Ness was, you know, working out of condoms, so that's fine. Where are you at right now, Ace? Uh, we just crossed the border from uh, California to Arizona. We're, uh, I think we're about like 100 miles away from Phoenix. Which seems like an hour to get there, but 100 miles would take us two and a half hours like, to get there. Which... I say, he, 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 my pussy is fat cap and ends at an Eno. Yeah, one condom. Yeah, I didn't wear a condom when I fucked a crackhead. Because I didn't have her sex with her vagina, dude, so... You don't look like a man, Kim. Don't pay attention to that incel donator has the same person donating toxic things over and over. You're our beautiful queen underscore carrot. Beautiful queen. Kim is thick as fuck, F would smash. Kim is thick as fuck, would smash. See what I'm saying? Like, they're very nice. I'm just kidding about the crackhead. Don't, don't worry. <laughs> Are we there I yet? Fuck a crackhead with Ness. I don't. Yeah, I, no, I didn't. Trust me. Yeah, you got that corn dog? I don't want it. Do you want it? Yeah. Are we there yet? No, man, we're not going to be there for another... I don't know. Fucking... The map says 16 hours, but that's bullshit. 25 hours. Honestly, how long... How many days do you think we're going to be driving for? Like, I say I can push myself through and just get there in fucking 20 hours, but realistically, I can't. I can't do that. I can't drive for 20 hours. That shit's hard as fuck. And I'm gonna get tired, and then I'm gonna put my life in danger by driving this big ass thing with, when I'm tired. So I don't know. Maybe like two days at most. I feel three days. Of course, it's, no, not definitely not five days. No way. did donate another media. Hold on to media. At the next fucking gas station, I'm gonna just pull over and see if I can fix it. Otherwise, uh, I don't want to scam. Because we have no fucking music. But when I see a gas station. Honestly, I'm gonna be excited. I'm like, I'm excited to go to Texas. I still can't believe that you're moving to Texas. Why? <laughs> I mean... California has outlived its whatever. Like, I, I want something new, you know, a new experience. I mean, when I travel, it's not going to change, but I want a new experience where I live. And also, I'm excited to go to Texas. You still have Robot Dandy version 1? Because that's the one that I want. Because you Texas, also said you were willing to give it to me. Texas has different vibes. And, uh, it's way fucking cheaper, so hopefully, uh, I don't know what that exactly would mean for me, but hopefully I could just, you know, save a lot more money, not have to pay expensive ass taxes, and, uh, I don't know, use more money for stream stuff instead of fucking, like, rent and shit. I do still have Robot Andy version 1, but hey, Robot Andy version Kim 1. Kim just don't pay attention to the 20 to 25 toxic people that are left the uh, other I 3K want it. watching, we all love you. It's the internet, there's always gonna be random trolls, but you're awesome underscore carrot. Oh, one six one Slager made you L underscore, L underscore, L underscore, L underscore, 
L underscore seven X seven seven streets in Dillion seven hundred seventy seven X tries in Dillion seven hundred seven X seven twins bridge in Dillion seven hundred seven X seven Hall Island Bridge in Dillion seven hundred seventy seven Church in Dillion seven hundred seventy seven Duo Tries in Dillion seven hundred seven X seven in Tries in Dillion seven hundred seventy seven X Tries in Dillion seven hundred seven X seven O One Rides in Dillion seven hundred seven X seven Oct I Rides in Dillion seven hundred seventy seven Sept Rides in Dillion Seven hundred seventy-seven sex vines and tulips. Seven hundred seventy-seven Quinn White. Wow, dude, that's amazing. Thank you so much, bro. You know, I took some adaptinol for this drive, so your sevens aren't gonna be able to fuck with me at all. Okay, motherfucker. I don't think you understand the power of modafinil. Okay, I, I can just ignore everything and just take it all in. It's like so easy. So. Um, yeah, Austin is, uh, I've been there a couple times. It's pretty cool. Like, it's a pretty nice city. They, they're really, they're really, it's really modern. And they have a lot of, like, like, really, like, happening shit. Like, I don't know, like, good restaurants and fucking, like, young-ass people everywhere. And, like, you know, just clubs and bars and conventions. And just, there's just a lot of shit going on there. And it's really nice. They have nice, like, they have lakes and shit, and trees, and that doesn't seem like that crazy, like fucking lakes and trees, but Texas is a big-ass desert, except for Austin. That Austin's, like, nice. Dallas and Houston, all these places are fucking deserts. And I like trees, so it's really nice. Visit San Antonio. I mean... I kind of just want to get the U-Haul to fucking Texas, to, or to Austin, dude. I don't really want to stop too much. Because I do not feel safe with all of our shit parked in a parking lot somewhere. I don't want someone to break into the fucking truck. Or her car. Because her car's in the fucking back, so we can just break into the car. Especially in the middle of nowhere. Like, if we stop at some fucking Bates Motel looking ass place here in the desert. First of all, I, I think we're getting murdered. That's why I don't really want to stop. Second of all, I think we're getting robbed. The last small motel that I went to had a, literally pulled a gun on me in Alaska. That fucking, that goddamn place. That was the last small hotel that I went to that wasn't like a chain place. Because I'm scared as fuck to go into some like hotel that's like run by some family of like fucking desert people weirdos. Hey bro, I live in Round Rock by Austin and got a big A tincture. Is Kim down a clown? We can spit roaster, pop some zannies and get strange. What do you think? And then also, uh, first of all, what the fuck? And also everyone in Arizona and Texas and shit have guns. Listen, dude, you're not... No. This guy... No. This guy says he's gonna give you some Xanax and you're gonna go drink and fuck him. What? No. Definitely not. Listen, buddy. You come anywhere near my Kimberly. Hey, Ice, I live in Texas. I have a ranch. I have four wheelers and 400 acres of fun. Well, in that case, invite me to the ranch and I will come over and we can have some fun. We can definitely have some fun. I'm kind of worried about living in Texas, to be honest, because I do know that... I don't know, just like... You should do a stream with Kim purchasing a puppy to bring to the new house. Let her pick the dog. I don't want Love some, you both. I don't want some crazy guy to fucking have a gun, like, fucking... I don't know, dude. If I throw an event or something, like, people come to try to fight me sometimes. Been I'm, watching since early days and never thought you could find a way to tank your streaming career like this. Still love you, though. I hope things get better in Texas cause it sure can't get worse. Uh, I mean, that's for sure. Don't stop in Williams, Arizona. The cops are mean. Ah, uh, well, we're not doing anything bad, so what are cops gonna say? Yeah, I don't know. I'm scared of guns, dude. That's all it is. And, like, Texas has a bunch of guns. And, like, I don't know. I'm just... I, I just don't like that shit. But, um... What was I gonna fucking say? I was, somebody, somebody said something about, um, you should stream getting a dog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get a dog. When I get over there, I'm gonna buy a fucking dog. And it's gonna be a small ass dog, because I like small ass dogs. And uh, 
I'll, I mean, I'll stream it. Like, I'll go to the fucking Humane Society and fucking stream it. And y'all can help me pick out a dog, but, yo, for real, that shit's not gonna die. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. Houston and Dallas are just as green as Austin. Don't say things you don't know about until you fully visit and explore these areas. The TX Triangle is Houston, San Antonio, and Austin. Get to know them. I, I mean, I will get to know them. I've been to Texas, or I've been to Dallas, and I didn't see any green anywhere, but I guess I'm wrong. Hey, Ice, I live in Texas. I have a ranch. I have four wheelers and 400 yes, acres of fun. You should come visit. I 100% do that. Well, because people in the chat probably think I'm going to kill the dog. They say, they say that all the time. You're gonna, the, dar, the dog going to starve to death. It's no. going to die. Or you're going to be the one to take care of it. Probably. No. <laughs> no. I, will, I will make sure it's the happiest dog. Okay, if you take care of it. Welcome to, to Austin Nice. Hope out. to see you around. I'd wake up at 5 a.m. and take the dog out. Yeah. Okay. I was just gonna get a, a fucking diaper, put a, a diaper oh, on it. No, I'm serious. I'll no. put, dude, I put a fucking diaper on my Yorkie. No, you're In Florida, or my mom's Yorkie, we had a diaper on it. Because we didn't want to fucking take it out. Because it goes to the bathroom literally every two hours. Because the bladder is like this big. So we put a fucking diaper on it and just shit and piss in that. And then we changed the diaper. Uh, hey, thank you, Jimmy. I appreciate that, dude. I'm glad you uh, enjoy it. The odds of me crashing are so low. This straight literally, or this street literally goes straight. It's only a straight street. There's no turning, there's no mountains. It's it's just flat and straight and desert. And even if I do crash off the road, there's nothing to crash into. I would show you if it wasn't dark. It's literally just flat sand everywhere. So, I mean, I mean the trailer would probably get a little fucked up, but whatever, hopefully the car wouldn't, I suppose. How slow are you driving? I'm going 52 miles an hour on cruise control because 55 kind of feels like really shaky and loud and I don't like that. So I'm going 52, which is fucking slow as shit, dude. I mean, I can drive pretty long though. I can drive long ass distances. Like if I want to drive to Austin right now, I think I could in one sitting. I just don't want to because eventually I'm going to start feeling like shit. Like when I came back from Vegas, I almost threw up in the car multiple times. I threw up my mouth like three times. I was so exhausted and tired because I didn't sleep at all since the isolation stream at that point. And then, you know, five hours in, my head got dizzy and I was seeing literally, I wasn't really seeing anything, but like, I could see like shadows and shit at the corner of my eye just like moving and, and I don't know, I just felt like shit, dude. And I was like, I need to get off this road ASAP. By that point, I was stuck in bumper to bumper traffic in LA. So I was only going like 10 miles an hour. So it's like, I, I'm like, all right, I can make it home. We're not even like having to drive. But like, if I was on the highway still, I would have just pulled over and fucking slept, dude. This what? Is so bad. Why, dude? So is that what the Discord said? No, I'm just hearing it. I'm just imagining. Dude, I can't even hear the squeak anymore. I, I just ignore it, dude. I mean, if anyone in the chat could tell us what that squeak is, we would fix it. But nobody knows. Shadows, yes, yeah, shadows, dude. I mean, because I was really tired. I mean, I think it's just like the whole truck as, like, collectively, you know what I mean? Gang shit, CX. Try to type Thank in you, your gang window. shit. What if it's like. It's not gonna be the windshield. What else would it be? It's like. like What's the plans house? for the truck, bro? Sell it and get an RV. Seems like the money pit. No, I don't, I don't want an RV. For what? Dude, sell what? Sell the truck. Sell what truck? What are you talking about? I don't have a truck. I'm moving furniture in the truck. I'm not. We're not living in this truck, dude. It's a fucking U-Haul, <laughs> bro. This ain't no fucking military truck, dog. Like, what are you saying? Yeah, I think it's the seat. Cause like now that someone said that. I can hear, like, it coming from the bottom of my dick. What happened to Hummer? Uh, I don't know. Scuff Steve Jobs, I'm pretty sure, just, like, put it at the house that he owns somewhere in Vegas or something. Hey, Ice, move the camera on Kimberly while you talk. She got that fine red spaghetti strap showing. I'm going to stroke the meat pickle while watching those bee cups bounce in the moonlight. I would love to show her on camera, but the camera angle's kind of weird, because, like, the truck is angled fucking weird, so, and the 
seat uh, next, like the camera's not wide enough for the seat next to us, so I think she's shy. What does that have to, I literally just sat over there and just moved away. That but you weren't on camera though. I know, but you Hey, I so glad to see you growing into more of a man and moving with your girl somewhere else. Also have Kim Reed chat more, we need to get her used to all the toxic comments, fix the squeak, call me homie. Yeah, you should read chat. Read it to you? No, I'm just, I mean, in, in general. Oh, man, fucking. First thing I'm gonna do when we get there is. Actually, I mean, I don't know, probably, I was gonna say unpack the furniture and get the house, like, set up because I wanna just get this shit done and over with. And I only have this truck for six days before they start overcharging me, so. I would like to get the truck back before six days. It's already been two. Um. I don't, I'm probably gonna have to hire movers to unpack the furniture, because there's a lot of goddamn furniture, and if I had to do all this by myself, if I had to do all this by myself, that will suck ass, that will take so long, dude, like, there's probably three bedrooms worth of furniture in the back, and, I mean, people do do it by themselves, but it just fucking sucks. I Texas, I have four wheelers and 400 acres of fun. Come visit. I will. I mean, just, if you I invite me. Chat said, they said, Kim, take care of our drug addict, Galvino. I mean, I would love you to take care of me. That'd be great. I want you to. <laughs> Somebody said, have viewers come help. Um, I would love to do that, but I don't really want to do that yet because I don't want the... I don't want the, the place leaked before we actually, I don't know, move in fully. Like, I don't want the place leaked at all. But, yeah, I mean, calling viewers over to help just doesn't help the case. Somebody will leak it. And I do not want that to happen. Even if it happens eventually anyways, because, it, you know, shit happens. I, it's just like, I don't want to invite it over, you know? But, we'll see. I, mean, I hear Salman Andy is there in uh, Texas, so maybe he can come help us move. And then afterward, we'll silence him. No, I'm just kidding, but. <laughs> you should move the camera a bit to her side. Ice and shakes less that way, cause the camera is shaking like hell, homie, when you have it pointing at you. Also, the squeak noise is terrible, oh. Uh, well, I can't stop the squeaking. And the shaking is, I can't stop that either, but I, I don't know, I can't get us both on camera, unfortunately. The truck is angled fucking weird. Like, maybe I could if I angle it differently. I'll try it. I'll pull over somewhere. Like I said, I have to see a fucking gas station to pull over. I, I can just pull over on the dirt, but I'd prefer not to with the trailer in the back. And we haven't seen a gas station. I made that tweet saying, that I'm looking for a truck stop so I can buy a, a phone mount since I fucking forgot and I packed everything. Um, dude, it took us like two hours to see a truck stop. I was pissed. I was like, what the fuck? I think it's because the truck goes so slow and what is normally 30 minutes in to each truck stop is like two hours for me. So, whose car's on the trailer? It's uh, Kimberly's car. She's uh, She's got her car, so... I think Boldestad gave his car away, so I, I'm, I, don't, I don't know what he's going to do in California, to be honest. Makes me wonder. Tell her to drive back? No. Why? It saves money to put it on the fucking trailer, dude. The trailer was only like an extra 200 I mean, that's fucking expensive, but it's originally, the trailer was supposed to be 500 but they gave me a deal. Bro. Penske is way better than U-Haul. Y'all should fucking use it when you move. I fucked up using U-Haul all these times. Penske gave me three discounts because I just Googled fucking discount codes. They gave me three discounts on top of each other. They gave me a $500 trailer for $200 because they didn't have the other one in stock. So they're like, yeah, take the more expensive one for free. I'm like, shit, thanks. And then fucking the miles are free. They don't charge for miles. So it's, uh, bro, this shit was like much cheaper and much just better. The truck's just better. It has a USB charger in it. 
the no charge for the miles thing is what really matters, though. Because that's literally, that would have been an extra, almost probably $2,000, $1,000, $2,000, so. Hey, you say no way a USB charger, but bro, U-Haul doesn't even have a, a fucking cassette player. Like, their trucks are shit. So this is, like, not bad. But, uh, yeah, this is also at the 26-footer, so it's just cheaper, dude. $200 cheaper than U-Haul as well, already. Welcome to Yee Yee Yeehaw Hill Country, Texas. You have to attend Austin City Limits. It's the biggest music festival there. Visit San Antonio in the future. The river walk is nice. Yikes in the chat. Okay, don't do that. As long as it's not country music, then we're good. Cause I fucking hate country music. I mean, Kimberly, you looked so hot in those knee high boots. Did you get to pay guys that night? Also, can you confirm that Burger has a eight incher? Do you prefer Ice's sexy she, body to his parachute she not, blob? She not fuck. <laughs> no, no, she, she ain't going anywhere near Burger Planet, dude. And second of all, I don't have a two inch penis. And third of all, country is shit music. And I shouldn't say that in Texas, but I'm saying now before I get there, country is shit. I hate it. I'll go to a country music festival to fucking be like, yo, this is fucking stupid, but uh, yeah, I don't like it, dude. If they don't have, like, I want to listen to fucking, you know, 21 Savage, dude. I'm going to be like, I'm going to spread the good gospel of fucking rap music over there. You'll be okay without Volt Savvy show his true colors anyways. Also, it's more healthy for your relationship for it to be just you and Kim. If anything, the new puppy dog will be more loyal than Volt. Uh, I don't see how he showed his true colors. It makes sense. Like, he DM'd me today, and he was, like, you know, saying that he just had something come up, and he couldn't, you know, leave California right now, and I'm just, I'm like, that makes sense. Okay. So, I don't see what you're saying, but thank you. Do I think it will help our relationship? I mean, I'll, I mean, yeah, sure. I mean, I don't think it makes too much of a difference, but, okay. Slight right. I'm pulling over into this. Continue for half a mile. I'm pulling over into this fucking truck stop so I can try to fix the, uh, the, the stuff. In a quarter stream. mile, merge onto I-10 East. Make the stream angle better and see if I can turn the fix the media. Or like or something. This truck stop looks like where you get murdered. I would face the camera the other way to show you, but uh, I can't. Can you pull into that one? Fuck, I fucked up. I can't because there's, it's on a fucking thing that's a holder and it's blocking the, the fucking phone, dude. The camera's okay. Yeah. Windows are not even electric, dude. They're manual, so you have to manually. Run. I have a 10k acre ranch with eight jeeps and 12 four wheelers and exotic animals to hunt. Oh, and it's bear mating season in Arizona, so watch out for bear crossings. CX. Bear. Yo. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? Are you okay. Yeah, I don't know. That fucking hurt for a second. I don't know why. That's that word. That's not good. I just released all the air on accident for the brakes. So now the brakes don't work. I don't believe you. I literally just released all the air. I don't believe you. Really? Yeah. What do we do? Stuck. Are we really? Yeah, we're stuck at the fucking truck stop in the middle of nowhere. No, I'm just kidding. No, that was, that was just the parking brake. Don't worry. All right, well, let me fucking fix this shit. Um, okay. I took a shower at a gas station fucking for right before my stream, so I feel great. The fucking water was cold as shit. Don't know why, but it fucking was. They said it was hot water, and I went in that bitch. It was hot for two minutes, and it got cold. I'm like, damn, I got scammed, dude. Okay, yo, if I put this bitch here. Oh, is that a better, is that a good ankle chat? But then when I'm driving, like, you just see my fucking nose the whole... You just see my nose the whole time, dude. Like, that's not a good angle. I don't like that. 
I do not have an air brake license, but yo, yeah, this have. this truck. I don't know, but this truck has a fucking air brakes on it because it's a heavy ass truck with a trailer. Yo, my fucking Laffy got stuck to the fucking door, dude. All right, this is a good angle, really. This is like some weird ass angle, dude. Y'all just want to look at my fucking nose the entire time. <laughs> Okay, whatever, dude. You can just, uh, we'll do this for a little, a little bit, I guess. Yo, how do I fucking, god damn it. Oh, I don't think it sticks to that. One sec. No, it does. Hold on. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. That's some, that's some good shit. Yo, this is the worst fucking thing I've ever bought. This what? phone holder is so bad. Dude, it was $30. I was like, this shit's gonna be good. This shit is so bad. Like, it's. It, it, you can't angle it for shit. And it's fucking scuffed. Okay, and I'll fix that media too. Okay, I don't. That, that, that's an awful angle. <laughs> that's an awful angle because you they can only see you. <laughs> is that a good angle, Kimberly? I'm the streamer now. They can just see you the, into the entire time. No, I don't. Yo, fucking, we gotta find this door. Nah, this ain't gonna, nah. This ain't gonna work, and people are just gonna come to you. They gonna come to you, Kimberly. Fucking Astral, he's gonna just fucking ejaculate. Okay. Yo, every angle is shit. That could just be a good angle, actually. What part of Texas? Sorry if you already said it. Uh, Austin. Austin, Texas. Yo, I should have bought another fucking thing. I hate this. Yo, how's the quality look, chat? I put it on a thousand bit rate just because, I mean, fucking, we're in the middle of nowhere. Okay. And uh, the live view and everything's packed, so. Yo, I don't, hmm. Oh, I know, I have an idea, I have an idea. Ooh. No. Do that's... you want me to hold it? Just hold it? I mean. For you to hold it for ten hours? No, but until I get tired. But I still need to put this somewhere. Somewhere. So when you're tired, you know. What? Do you have an idea? No. Oh, fuck. God damn it. <laughs> fuck, dude. No. Okay, Kimberly. So Looks like you can, you're gonna have to hold it. If you want, for a little bit at least. I mean, that, 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 the same angle we had, it just works. I mean, it's not the best, but it, it works. Now, let me see if I can fix this shit, this media. Let's see. I don't know how on the phone. I don't know why it's not working. Let's see here. Don't, don't be shy, Kim. We already saw your face for like 15 hours in Japan streams, lol. I mean... I know, but I got shy again. Why? I don't know. I'm weird. They only said that you look nice and your butt is huge. You're not fucking weird, dude. Why do you think you're weird? Because I get anxious right now. There's nothing to get anxious about, dude. Don't worry about it. Kimberly, you're amazing. And you're, you're, the, you're the best thing that has ever happened to your cat's life. <laughs> Thank you. That just came my life. Okay, um, yeah, booger, booger, homie, fucking DBZ, you know, okay, yo, fucking, I don't know how this shit works, well, I know how it works, but I, I don't know why it's just not working, yo, okay, no music then, it just, it's supposed to pop up, but it doesn't, <laughs> let me check one more thing real quick, yo, because we're wasting time, and I will, we're, we're never gonna get there if this is, if we have to stop every fucking... God knows how many times. Like, I only want to eat food once. Okay, we can, we're only going to go to- Hey, Ice, is it true that Sam and Andy found out your new address and is getting- Hey, Ice, is it true that Sam and Andy found out your new address and is getting airlifted by helicopter to your front door, comma, question mark? He said, don't worry, he will just do dance moves and sleep on your balcony, wow. <laughs> Sam and Andy? Okay, I'm fucking sleeping in the dumpster, homie. 
I'm just kidding. But no, he doesn't know. But thank you. Um, that would be interesting, though. I was gonna say something, but I forgot. Okay. Oh yeah, we're only gonna eat food once. So whatever city you want to eat Denny's in, that, <laughs> Denny's. that's your one. That's your one stop. Okay. I'll remember that. All right, we gotta get out. Wait, I, but we're gonna I, stop. A ghost politics is watching your stream. <laughs> um, no, we're, well, yeah, we're going to sleep, but we're not going to eat. We don't have time for that. We're going to eat in one Denny's in one city. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, ghost, okay, yo, what's up, ghost? CX in the chat. How you doing, homie? Thank you, dude, for uh, Big Baby for the member, dude. Ghost, you sound like the type of dude. CX in the chat. Who lives in, I can't watch your stream this time, but you sound like the kind of dude that lives in fucking Texas, bro. Is that true? Or like, you seem like you live in New Mexico or something. I don't fucking know. Yeah, my phone's at 9%. Why the hell? Oh, I know why. Oh. Huh. Let me know. Plug the charger in here. There we go. Alright, back on the road. I can't fix the media. Sorry, guys. I don't know why it's fucking broken on the phone. It just doesn't work. If we, when we park, fuck. God damn it. When we park, I'll try to, uh, get it to work, but I don't know why it's not working right now, and I just want to fucking not waste time. Okay. Is she anxious because you're driving? No. No. My driving's good, isn't it? It's better in a U-Haul. Yo, because it's so big, I can't fucking do dumb shit. And your braking doesn't make people car sick, she can't I mean, because it's air brakes. Yeah. What is this? This is the only time you will ever get to see Cam you and Cam in a car together. Show us, both of you. Yo, fucking, the camera's not wide enough. Hold on, let me, uh, why is this shit, bro? My shit, my, my app is not working no more. I'm gonna do that DMG on Twitter and donate for gas. Could use a friend off stream. Okay, I mean, we'll see how... It goes, I have to meet you first before we decide that. Yo, this shit's broken, Kimberly. I don't know how to fix it. The stream is, is, the app is fucked. No, you think I'm lying about the air brakes, look. It says, brake air. Oh, well, I don't know if it's an air brake. When I hit the, look at this. You hear that? That's a fucking, that's air being released on the brakes. It's 100% air brakes, dude. It's a brake that breaks with air instead of metal. Let me just restart the app. What happened with EBC? He's your friend, you big jerk. What the? No, he came over and uh, we were just moving. We were busy moving, so I said hi to him. We talked for a little bit, and then that was it. Yeah, I'm gonna do the DMD you in Twitter and donated for a gap. Okay. I at least fixed that, so fuck it. I guess the media just. I figure out the media another time, I guess. Now we have to get this angle again. God damn, this fucking piece of shit. I brought the worst one, I guess. I thought it was the most expensive one, so I thought it was good, but it's shit, dude. Kim is helping you out so much. You should take her on a vacation after you settle in. There's a nice resort not too far from Austin you could take her to. It's called Horseshoe Bay. <laughs> Never forget. CX. I mean, realistically, we could go to Horseshoe Bay. Dude, that, it was a nice place. Is air brakes safer than other brakes? Lol. Uh, is air brakes safer than other brakes? Yeah, because, it, I mean, I don't know why. It just, it stops big-ass trucks, and it fucking 
you don't feel shit, so I mean, it's more comfortable. Horseshoe Bay, actually, it's a nice place. Like, it's, they have lakes and butlers and the tears of my ex. I don't want to go there. Yeah, me neither. Fuck, I hate that goddamn place. Never want to go back there again. Okay, let's, uh, <laughs> let's fucking figure out how to goddamn put this back on. So I need 20k to move all by yourself? Uh, well, most of that money is from paying the rent for fucking a bunch of months up front, so my credit is shit. And then the rest was the fucking moving, like the truck and stuff. Yo, this, how did I have this before? I, I fucked up, Kimberly. I fucked up, baby. I can't figure out how to put this on there. Do you want me to hold that while you do it? You're gonna get tired. Well, no, you. But I want to read the. I want to read the chat. Uh, no, because I have to put it on to test it. Yo, now the shit doesn't even stick. No, dude. There we go. What happened to you? You used to be hysterical, edgy, and unconventional. Sam Pepper rubbed off too much on you, and you turned against your entire community. Disgusting normie. Enjoy 3K viewers, lol. Okay, thank you, dude. I'm literally driving a fucking truck, homie, but thank you. I appreciate that. You can see you tomorrow. Alright. Fuck it. This is fine, I guess. No, it looks is like... Is it safer than F-13 M6 brakes? Alrighty. Yo, I want to neck right now. I'm just gonna... just. Can you run me over with the truck? I'm just kidding. Yo, yeah, it's much safer. Ah, Kimberly, I'm in the neck. No, I'm just kidding. It doesn't work on the windshield, dude. It only, it works. Can I buy some of your cubes? Willing to pay a oh, lot. Oh, no a way. Dick. Yo, hold up. I did not, bro, I tried it earlier. It didn't fucking work. Yo. Yo, that's some gang shit. That's some good shit. Yo, hold up, hold up. All Yo, right. Dick Austin, man. Holy cow, it's a lot less homeless people to start. People in general are pretty generous. Don't worry about these haters, dude. They don't care about your sanity, clearly. What if I... Oh! Thank you, dude. Yeah, I don't want to fucking hang out with homeless people either, dude. But Austin, I know it's really nice, man. I've been there a couple times. Let me... One more time, let me... Ah. <clears throat> yeah, baby. Off. I'll put it upside down. Fuck. I'm so sorry. We're never gonna get to fucking Texas, dude. We're gonna we're gonna live in this fucking truck. Because Ford Fusion is on the trailer in the Twitter picture. We're gonna live in this fucking truck. We're gonna be just like Scott Steve Jobs the next week. No, we're gonna be I in this to. we're gonna sleep here, we're gonna eat here. We're gonna set up a dining table in the back. We already have furniture in the fucking <laughs> back. Get some food. I can put it in there. Alright. Yo, I guess there's no water here. Yo, to be honest, this truck is better than the fucking mansion right now. Because, like, yeah, it had no fucking hot water and no air conditioning. There's at least air conditioning, air conditioning in here. here. Like, I would rather live in this truck. Fucking Penske truck, dude. The, the <laughs> mansion. At, 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 that, at the end of it there. Alright, yo, dude, I fucking want a neck. Wait, let me fix, let me t tighten this now. Oh my god, I think I fixed it. Andy. Yo, there's literally. <laughs> I want to get out of this truck stop, dude. I don't like it. Got homeless people walking around already. Okay. So, I don't know how there's homeless people in the desert, dude, but I just see fucking weirdos walking around. <laughs> He's not homeless. He probably drives a truck. Oh, yeah. Fuck this truck. I love the Joker smile, Kim God. Truck Put her on some oh, white makeup with red lipstick and hit the donkey butt from behind with an Afro wig and red ball nose. She can get this ball nose. Does she gag on suck? Does she gag on suck? What the fuck does that mean? Yo, she gags on nothing. What are you talking about, dude? Alrighty. I know, uh, if you said, uh, if you think, if you said the stream was like you're shot, or you're not shot, you said that if you're nervous about it, don't worry. Being on camera forcibly by myself or by your boyfriend will help you. 
hope we're not coming down a one way. It's just a one way or something. All right. To Texas. Yeah. Woo. Just another 17 hours or something. Alrighty. Can't miss it very pretty, yes. You know, if we stop and get food at like a Denny's or something, I'll stream that. Like, I mean, if it's in the middle of nowhere, like, I think we could. So, I'll definitely, like, I'll down for that. Get some good old. Fashion IRL there. What do you think, Paula? F10 M5 or E9 EM5? Uh, uh, what? What do you think? Fuck, oh, shit. What do you think? Motherfucker, what is that? What is an F10 M5? Is that like a motor? Yeah, it's probably an F10. No, this is this is international. It's an international. You are car. connected by the neck with Brian. Please just let go. Well, me and Scuffy Jobs don't work together anymore. So, like he went a separate way. Went my separate way. Oh fuck! Oh, it's like, bro, no we're good. It's just, what the fuck was that? My keys. Okay. Yeah, it's just me. Enjoy this free dollar. Can you hear anything? I can't hear. Thank you, Free Logan. I appreciate that. Yeah, I can hear this phone. It's. Not as loud as it could be, which makes it hard to, a little harder to hear, but I can still hear it pretty well. Uh, I wish we we need to get that speaker. We need to find a fucking Bluetooth speaker. Yo, does anyone know how to get the fucking blue the Bluetooth and a Penske working? Because we can't get it to fucking work. I don't know why. The East Texas Drive is going to be pureed. Are you both driving or just taking sleep breaks? It says Bluetooth, but it doesn't work. Yeah, hold on, why can't we up? If you don't let me buy your I'm going to punch the man sitting next to you. So this guy wants to buy your, your car. Or I punch you, but I'm not going to do that. This guy's an idiot. Thank you, dude. Seen the death of a dynasty. R.I.P.C.X. Yo, for real, I'm trying to read this, but it's so bumpy and I have to look up, and this is an awful place to read. I, I missed one. Paul the first genuinely thought you were on your way to being the next Howard Stern. Your path was so obvious. But instead you decided to take so much time off, listen to SSJ idiot, and abandon everyone. Sad. What the fuck are you talking about, dude? My path was so obvious, but instead I take time off? Bro, I could scream! I am an artificial intelligence research scientist in Silicon Valley and I have insider information about the EBZ booger clip. I can confirm the booger video is a deep fake. Yeah, the East Texas drive would probably be shit. Yo, I couldn't stream, bro. Fucking, that's not fair. <laughs> like, the city of LA was gonna give me a fine if I streamed in the house. So I pretended not to half the time. And then I had fucking everyone, I had the landlord bitching about the fuck streaming in the house because he would get fined too. You know, Brent was fucking not happy that I streamed in the house because he would get bitched, by, bitched out by the landlord. Like, I couldn't fucking stream, dude, and then obviously I couldn't really, like, I don't know, it's just bad. What's shit going on? What's the dude? I didn't ban everyone, what are you talking about? I literally am just, I can't take everyone with me to Texas, dude. I mean, I guess theoretically I could, but that's just, I don't want to do that. <laughs> she's not texting anybody, she's, uh, probably a... So, so don't sadist. Do you realize what's going on? I mean, he didn't ditch. <laughs> like, that's not what happened. He. I didn't mean her pubes ice. I meant the guy sitting next to you. His pubes. No. What the fuck? She's a. This a. You literally person, shut down your Reddit and that was nail in the coffin. You are a complete and total moron. Um, the Reddit is toxic. More on your Reddit made you. Reddit. Appreciate it very much. Okay. Fucking, uh, told this guy did a ditch. He just had shit going on. Like, uh, he hit me up today and just told me some stuff. So I'm like, okay, that makes sense. So, I don't know. Like I said, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully he still does Purple Army Radio eventually. I don't know. We'll see how, uh, how it all works out, I guess. I mean, 
It's just going to be me and uh, Kimberly for a little bit. At least until I meet new people in Texas. I hope to meet new people, new friends, new people, you know, see how things work. I'm really excited, too. I have lived in the same place for three years now. I'm excited to meet new people and do new things and find new, like, you know, places to go, you know, restaurants and, you know, things uh, around the area that I can go to and enjoy, so... Moving is pretty nerve wracking, but I kind of like it. I, I like having to like. Hey, dude, would you sell Kim's like. dirty underwear to us? We want that Kim Possible snail trail. Sniff that shit up like a daily boof stick. Anyway, love you. Keep it up. This Kim do suck sex or handy best. I can't take how toxic out of these TDS are. Jesus. Here is my last donation to contribute to the trip. I'll hit you up on Twitter and have a safe trip, you too. Hey Ice, long time fan, first time donator. If you come to Vancouver, I'll give you a fat blunt. Th thank you, baby boys. I appreciate that, man. Uh, hit me up on Twitter, homie. Yo, I would love to hit a fat blunt with you, but thank you, dude. And I'm not selling, I, can't, I don't, I mean, I guess I would ask her. This guy wants to buy your underwear, like your dirty ass underwear. He said he'd give you $250. Give me two hundred and give me two hundred and fifty dollars, and I'll steal her panties for you. No, give them yours. I don't. I mean, people might want my underwear, maybe, but like, why? Unless you're gay, I don't know why. I mean, if you give me ten dollars, I'll steal her underwear. Ten dollars. I mean, what? No, for McDonald's. <laughs> talking about <laughs> I remember I tried selling something on eBay and it got it, it got banned Kimberly Ice has sacrificed a lot of easy girls to be with you from the meetup in Missouri you lured him in and you have the nerve to be texting Ryan and swiping right while he's right next to Y what, what about an E46 M3 or an E92 M3 What? Not like girlfriend, it's like a girlfriend that's a girl. Okay, I'm about to say. You shat on everything. CX was great. You ruined a good thing. Now everyone will focus on you for content. You made it twice as hard for yourself. Goofy moves, as usual. I mean... You are the most pathetic dude ever. You built the greatest community ever. And literally shut it down because of a bunch of total morons in your ear. You had a call to your fingertips. Nice job, idiot. Why would someone buy your only pair of underwear, Paul? You barely have four shirts. <laughs> I feel like the same guy donated twice with like alts or something. Homie, I shut down the CX network. You're right. People had other things to focus on if I didn't go live. But that's not necessarily a good thing. The it's dude in the passengers stuff. is super creepy. Like, it just, that shit's taking too much of my time, and I, I, I just want to focus on myself, dude. I want to, like, build a healthier community, so I don't want, you know, if Burger Planet fucking is accused of raping girls, you know, I don't want that to be, like, talked about that, like, not really, like, I'm trying to build, like, I guess they could be talked about, but what I'm trying to say is I don't want people to, like, I don't know, I feel like it just creates some bad vibes, or, like, a bad precedent, or, I don't know, something, dude. I want... Them. I want Stop the, fucking know, talking drama and text to speech fuck off. I want the uh the, I want the uh this community to talk about funny things, you know, memes and whatever funny shit. I don't want it to be like, did this person like actually find a girl and fucking follow her home and I don't know. Because it reflects poorly on me in the end of the day, and that's what I was really concerned about. Why would anyone buy your dirty underwear? You barely have four shirts. I mean want to smell my sweat, I guess, and, and ball sack. The dude in the pastor is too, okay, creepy, That's, yeah, sure, dude, girlfriend dog, um, and no, dude, I literally, I, I literally kidnapped Ryan, dude, he's not, like, I literally got rid of him, like, I blocked him on her phone, and then I fucking, I unblocked him, pretended to be her, met up with Ryan, you want funny I, things? 
You want memes? Locked his ass How does it feel that you and Hampton Brandon both have three K viewers, but you're on YouTube and he's on an irreverent D-Live website? Get meme, get meme, get meme, G. Okay. <laughs> Fuck it, dude. Let me tell you something, homie. Um. Shutting off your Reddit was the dumbest thing ever. Oh my God. I always put up with all the crap bad choices you make. But that was just so moronic on another level I cannot forgive you. That was disgusting, man. Yes, my Reddit is open, though. Except, it's not, uh, fucking AIDS. <laughs> it's, I mean, it's not much right now, but, uh, when I get back to Reddit recaps, I'm gonna keep it from being AIDS again. Heavy moderation. It's not necessarily a bad thing. If people just post memes, it's fine. But if people start doing hate threads, no. No, I don't want hate threads. Because who cares? Like, I don't care. If you want to hate on somebody, you fucking do it somewhere else. You know, the Reddit's not meant for... I don't want it to be meant for hate threads. And that's what it was for, like, I did, what, three months straight? So... I don't know, dude. It's fine. And I know, you know, content equals memes and all this stuff, but... Still, it was... It was, uh... I already told you why I shut it down. It was basically either shut Can down. Can people please stop being mad about the move, Imp? It was basically like shut the Reddit down and, and uh, you know, stay in the house, keep the investors, keep the company going. Or I keep the Reddit open and the investors will pull out. But they did anyway, so <laughs> it doesn't really fucking matter. But I tried to prevent that from fucking happening. That's why. That did happened. you think we like going on ice crap too? That Reddit is beyond horrible. It's just all hate toward you. The old Reddit before you closed it down was so epic. You killed your own community, you big goof. TBH, I miss the CX network. You had a strong brand in that all day, all the time you can access ice content combined with Reddit. It's like Marvel clothes and you can only get Spider-Man on Fox again. You people, in text-to-speech, never stop talking about drama WDF. It's okay, Ruben. There's nothing else to talk about while we're driving. I mean, like I said, my Reddit's open, and I do want to do more events and stuff that involves Reddit. There's just going to be moderation, so just have that as the expectation. If you want some somewhere that has no moderation, then, you know, maybe somewhere else is better for you. Uh, but if you want to use my Reddit and get recognition... The man in the passenger seat is creeping me out, but he probably has nice pubes. And also, uh, I don't, there's nothing wrong with moderation. I want my Reddit to Imagine have. Brenda Boy's lying about Brenda having 3K viewers. Good one, dude. Okay. The CX brand is also still very strong. I don't know how else to explain that. Kimberly, 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 Kimberly. If this doesn't gets to Texas and doesn't stream minimum of six days a week, six to eight hours a day, then bet you slap this peasant, bet you slap this peasant, bet you slap this CX. You slap me anyways. <laughs> Star Zoom Noizudo. Have any Bluetooth capabilities at the moment? Kimberly, Paul has done a terrible job about introducing you to the community. I think that's part of the reason why so many of them hate you. You should tell us about yourself and show us your feet. T A X. Actually, that's a good idea, though. Remember you broke your bed in light in Florida? Yeah, I still have that shit in the back, the same bed, same lamp. Kimberly, you should tell them about yourself. What they want to know? I mean, let's pretend you're on... I don't know, let's just pretend like this is my friend Bobby. Okay? 
my bed. This is my friend Bobby. Tell Bob, tell, tell Bobby about yourself. No, I'm not good at that kind of stuff. Like, right. But no, you're good at no, you're good no, at job no. interviews, though. Yeah. Okay. This is your new manager. Tell them why you should get hired for your for this job at my girlfriend. No, I want to be fit for this like streaming job. I don't know. I just over time. you in this world. No, just... Okay. Eventually she'll... Eventually you'll, you'll open up. I will. She'll open Your Reddit up. Reddit is worth 10x more than those investors. Don't you get that? You really need a knock on the head man. And of course they pulled out any wall, you moron. Disloyal scumbag weasel. Peanut brain. Uh... Okay, thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Yes, the Reddit is valuable was very valuable. Have ever spit in your girl mouth? Yeah. I mean, that's Hey, dude, why don't you do more filthy Frank or jackass style shit instead of Howard Stern or whatever? Don't try to get too normy with it. Anyway, tell Kim I'd love to bend her over and smell that hole. I mean, I kind of much do filthy Frank shit anyways with a little Howard Stern to build. Uh... <laughs> Only I can do smell that, okay? I'm the only one who's not to do that, so stop. Thank you. Actually, if you want to know about her, just join the Discord. She talks in Discord fucking a bunch. So, uh, maybe you'll become her new uh, Discord friend. Oh yeah, it's squeaky again. Fuck, I'm sorry. And if you talk about Kimberly anymore, I'm gonna ban you, bud. No, I'm just kidding. Hi. I'm just kidding. It's fucking Burger Planet cosplay. That's what that is, okay? We're in a goddamn car. <laughs> Hello. Swerving, dude. I'm getting scared. Oh, fuck. Okay, that's not the button for cruise control. I keep getting them mixed up, dude. How long have we been driving? We've been driving since, what, 11.30 in the morning, and it's 9.45 right now? How long is that? 10 and a half hours? 11 hours? Really? Yeah. This has been a quick-ass 11 hours, I'll say that. I fucking hate driving, too, but this shit's easy. Like, it's fucking boring as fuck, but it's easy. No, if we crash chat... I'm fucked. My whole life is fucked. I have my whole life in the back of this goddamn truck. She has a Do lot of Do not advertise your pedo discord. Nobody but Asian Andy and his gang of munchkin child fuckers want to use your disgusting age riddle discord. Rebuild your Reddit, dude. Keep plugging it, bro. Dom. Thank you, homie. Yes, when hey, I Hey, it's me, Riot. Meet at the agreed upon location in Texas. Pa blocked me from your phone. You won't have to take that goblin dick for much longer. Just stick to the plan. It will all be over soon. Thank you, Chad. Okay. Um, How much further have we got? Uh, fucking 14 hours? No, 15, 16 hours. Uh, Yo, why is Kimberly wearing a diaper? Hours. Is she one of those adult babies? What are you saying, dude? Why is Kimberly wearing a diaper is one of those adult baby what? that's a blanket dude uh and my discord's not aids dude if you think the discord's aids you probably good lord most you need to learn how to make on, on some real female shit you need to learn how to make friends on on the discord or you think it's aids because you probably get bullied in it because you're a fucking white name. one have a very safe drive two go tubing at the guadalupe river three go to a livestock show in rodeo four visit south padre island five health happiness and love yo do not advertise your pedo discord. Nobody but Asian Andy and his gang of munchkin child fuckers want to use your disgusting age riddle discord. Rebuild your Reddit, dude. Keep plugging it, bro. Dom. Don't no. miss you lots, Kim. Much love. Jacob. Okay. Actually, they do miss each other, but not for the reason you think. <laughs> okay, asshole. I miss Do you ever too. wait till you have a long sweaty day and your meat is just rock hard and ask Kim to choke on it? Like <laughs> just drop your sweaty balls right on Kim's forehead and just let her jerk and suckle. Oh, oh. 
<laughs> what? No, listen. Listen, dude, I don't fucking do that. Like, when I'm sweaty, I shower. Because that's inconsiderate otherwise. You two are going to need to get cowboy boots and cowboy hats once you're in Texas. Did you say you went to Vegas after the last stream? Yeah, um, cowboy shit, I'm down. Yeah, I went to, I flew to Vegas at 6 o'clock in the morning to pick up this goddamn truck. Because it was Cal Gun Peterson is the greatest guitar player in Texas okay. if you cross his path. Paul you Wall's found the best rapper night. as well. Paul Wall was the number one rapper from Texas. I want to meet his ass. Chameleon Air was also good too. If I can cross his path, then, uh, that'd be good. Okay, fucking. What the fuck was I saying? I got it. I have a few questions for you, Kimberly. Have you ever been blacked? No. Also, is Paul really into seeking things in his pee hole? Tell us something embarrassing about Paul. Also, do you like BBC? Okay. We want to work out. Streams, bro. You will feel good. I could do those again. Um, tell, tell them something embarrassing about me. Kimberly seven 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 red bra seven 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 red bra seven 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 I take my short stone seven 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 red bra seven 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 sex four seven 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 red bra seven 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 seventy seven you make me come some more seven 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 red bra seven 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 red bra seven 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 yo these Discord is AIDS Discord is AIDS rebuild your Reddit and listen to this damn community for once if you want to rebuild Discord is AIDS Discord is AIDS. Open your ears. Rebuild the Reddit. AIDS. Fuck you. I'll work on the Reddit. I'll work on the Reddit, but the Discord's not AIDS, bro. I think. How is it AIDS? Tell me how it's AIDS. Like, motherfucker, I'm on it all the time. What's AIDS about it? People literally don't say anything bad. Uh, they just troll. Okay, thank you, Kimmy. Um, what do you think is embarrassing about me? Something, even if they know it, what do you think is embarrassing? Like some embarrassing thing about me, or that I would do, that's embarrassing for myself. Seven, 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 Everyone thinks Discord is AIDS, but you Discord is AIDS, Discord is AIDS, rebuild the Reddit, Discord is AIDS, but you Discord is AIDS, Discord is AIDS, rebuild the Reddit, Discord is. I like the Discord, I don't know. Like what? It's not, I don't think it's AIDS. Or is every Discord AIDS, or is it just mine? Like, I fucking, what the hell do you mean? I thought it's on there, I look at it all the time, I bought it myself. What's AIDS, like what is AIDS about it? could say like all this stuff, but every Discord, I mean, <laughs> it's just like photo, like pictures and memes and stuff, that's mostly what it is, and then people talking to each other, it's like in a chat room. found embarrassing about me before was uh, how I'm loud in public. Hey Kim, what does Paul's butthole smell like? Have you guys ever buried yourself in each other's meat and buckets? I'd slurp that snail up like a noodle if I were you. Do you like the play ball? No, we've never buried ourselves in our fucking... No, dude, what? Meat buckets. Dude, it's not even that it's AIDS. It's just super low, low, low quality I content. We are not a bunch of leaps and losers who need Discord buddies to talk with. We just want to see amazing posts on Reddit. That's actually something I can agree with. Sorry, Discord. Are you ready? Wait for it. 
wait for it. Go for it. Yeah, I don't know. Something was supposed to read out, but didn't. I'll read it in a second. Remember when we were all at the Mexican restaurant and you guys? Oh yeah. You already know. Say, tell the story, dude. What did I do at a Mexican restaurant? I want you to tell them what you said to the poor old lady. I don't remember what. Bro. Yes, you do. I said, "Are you sucking dick or something?" No, you asked her if she wanted to see you. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, that was weird. I was just joking. Okay, so we went to a Mexican restaurant a while ago and uh, with like a bunch of people and I asked, I was being loud and we had like four margaritas. I was fucking drunk as fuck and uh, I asked the waitress who was probably like 70 years old if she wanted to see my dick. I was like, do you want to see my dick or something? I don't really remember but yeah, Kimberly was there. I think Kyle was there. I think Harvey J was there. Was there. Bro, Harvey J and fucking Blade and fucking yeah, you know, just everyone in the house was there. Yeah, I had like four margaritas. I was fucked, and then I, I don't know. And then I, I just upset. You can rebuild our community if you just rebuild your Reddit. That's the key. Remember that. Thank you, dude. Yeah, I was just joking though. Ice looking like a snug over here. I cuddle with him without a cack. And I was also really drunk, and this was a while ago. And fucking, I don't know. I didn't really mean to. I was just, I don't know. I got carried away. We were all like doing dumb shit. I just got carried away. I was like, we we were doing who, who could do the dumbest shit is what the game was. Yes, it was. I can't wait my dick right now, but thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Thank you, Joycelyn. In fact, this Kimberly should deal with sleep. Seven sextillion six hundred ninety-seven quintillion six hundred ninety-seven quadrillion six hundred ninety-seven trillion six hundred ninety-seven billion six hundred ninety-seven million six hundred ninety-seven thousand six hundred ninety-seven. Seven sextillion six hundred ninety-seven. I didn't finish the corn dog. Ice, you are the worst finance major in the history of community college. 70k for a broken down army truck. Normie streamer house. Listening to anything SSG says. Flying leeches on free vacations. Kim, do you like when Paul lick your anus? Because I like when my BF lick my anus. I feel so good. BTW, you look like you like choking and other BDSM stuff. Do you? I... I fucking blew people to Hawaii because I was grateful for them being on the network. And it was good content. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm, I didn't the really The only advice I really have manager. is, if you're going to have a new network, make sure you only allow streamers who can actually create content without you being there. Not just random snipers you meet. I mean, that's kind of harder said than done because you don't know who's going to have content or not until... Put them on, I guess. Um, but, you know, definitely you should vet people out more for sure. If I hey, Kim, how small is Paul's PP? He's really self conscious about it, and that picture of him in his underwear with him pulled up really high makes it look like it's the size of a button or acorn. Fucking huge. It's okay. Realistically, it's seven inches. I always say this. Can you confirm? Or deny seven inches. I don't want to be on stream talking about this stuff because I don't want it to affect my job. That's true. Sorry, you're right. I mean, listen, I didn't want to say this, chat, but I guess I'll just put it out there. She gave me a chastity belt, okay? And we're waiting until marriage to have any to do anything okay so like i you don't under like i i i mas no i don't masturbate she's all like i can't do that either <laughs> i'm a turkey baster i suck my cum out that's what i do
But yeah, if I have a network slap mode, then of course that's true. But I don't know if I would make another one. So, but thank you, dude. I appreciate that. The driving, looking at this, is so fucking difficult. And she's not reviewing, bro. Thank you. Dude. I appreciate that. So, so. What's the longest you guys have ever driven in a car for? Like, not driven in a car. There is a way to make sure they're entertaining. How was the longest? It's called requirements. Average view count. Active viewers. Subscriber count. I feel like you gave way too many boring people your spotlight. Why everyone's so harsh out here on the stream? I get the Reddit thing, but Dame. You know. She seems nice, though. Enjoy your ride 777. Dude, I've been driving for like... Well, Did you ever right eat now. your girl V and smell like tuna and was like, go take a douche? No, we don't do that, remember? And don't worry, Skirzy, they just, they just like, bring us stuff up. I mean, it makes sense, but, yeah. Um, I saw a clip of people saying that I'm cheating on Kimberly with no Haru. Paul, <laughs> listen to me. Those fussness and find us made some kind of heat, okay? Of his and how I got way to you. Yes? Gee, how hot you are. It's funny. Listen. Gay. Adds not even small. 77,777,777 million seven hundred seventy-seven thousand seven hundred seventy-seven from Joesm and DF as an adjustment. Seven seven. I look at your pretty face. Seven seven. Red bra. Seventy seven. I shake down my shorts. Seven hundred seventy-seven. Finger up my ass. Seven hundred seventy-seven. Shit for loop. Seven seven seven. Red bra. Seven seven seven. I lick my man boobs. Seven seven seven. Red bra. Seven seven seven. My favorite whore. Seven seven seven. Cool more. I took a shower and no Dude, Caroline is married. That's kind of hilarious. Do you think you might marry Kim? I think Kim is pretty cool. But it's so funny the alien is married. She is so disgusting. Kim is much better nice. I would say disgusting, but Are both of you scary. wearing seatbelts? Protect autism. Also, is autism good? good? Please wipe the road. Okay, you heard it. We took a shower at Noah's house together, so... Did not... Here are the CX Network. You are the CX community. The plebs might fade out, but you will carry us all to glory in the end. Seven inches denied. Okay, thank you, Jason. That's very kind of you, Flatter. Send this video to all the hair salons in Texas and Missouri so Kiki can't get a job. Ha 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 hairdresser, ha 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 goblin dick, ha 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 paint a date, Paul Ganino, ha 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 still in love with Ryan, ha ha. Okay, thanks so much. Thank you, bro. Jesus Christ, that squeaking reminds me of my mom's bed when she's with one of her clients, Skeptical777. Your mom sounds like a fucking prostitute. Okay. We took a shower together. We don't, like, I didn't go over to her house by myself to fucking shower. Like, y'all are retarded. Like, if I was out here really cheating, motherfucker, I wouldn't say it on stream. Like, that's, that's retarded. That sounds bad, but you know what I mean. I could drive for another 20 hours, probably. Like, I'm fine. I don't feel bored. I don't feel bad. I feel good. I'm energized. I'm not even hungry. I had a half a corn dog. I'm good. Where did the other half go? I don't fucking know. It's on the floor, I think. Really? Or something. Like, motherfucking, like, yo, this shit is great. It's the oh, cup. Yo, the, oh, I did eat it. Yeah, that's right. The stick. I forgot that I ate it, dude. Well, I have a laffy taffy, dude, so we're good. No, it's not the Coke. Dude, Coke only lasts 20 minutes. It's not fucking Coke. But daffodil, dude. I'm telling you, bro, this shit. You stay awake for fucking literally 20 hours. Kimberly is my mommy. I want to suck at her toes all day and be her dog. Mommy Kim, you are so beautiful and full of sunshine and glory. When you look up from your phone, my heart flutters. Mommy Kimmy. You Kim not? being honest won't affect your job opportunities. You're the more you mention stuff like that, the more the community will go out of their way to actually do that. Figure it out, little bruises. Paul, do you ever pulled out the seven inch on Kim and she's all like, who woo? And then you just dropped the flesh banana out on her and just ran it in. No loop. She says I want single tear rolls down. 
You smile. We are waiting until marriage. If you were single, I would lick your eyes all night. <laughs> uh, thank you, Rico. I'm your girl over there, dude. First, pour a little water on the squeak. It'll stop for good. Second, Scott it? Kim was on 11 guys' streams trying to make one be her boyfriend. You're just the sucker that fell for her. Scam artist Kimberly. I don't know how to stop it. Where is it? I don't even know where it's coming from. But I thought it was a seat, but I don't know anymore. Pull over again? How, but when we pull over, it's not going to squeak anymore, so we won't know where it's coming from. Um, hey, Ice, does a modafinil make your pee smell weird? This stuff no. kick ass. BTW fix that squeak. Buy some oil. Oil? But Looking no. back, don't you what? wish you didn't do what that to Sam? For? He really was a true friend. What do you think about your talk with him? I wish you the best. CX. Put oil on what, dude? The fucking dashboard? Uh, yeah, Sam was a good friend. I made a mistake. You've with been that. driving like seven hours. You hit El Paso when you have driven 12. Uh, yeah, Sam, I made a mistake with the whole drama thing on accident, but. Or, not with the drama thing, but, you know, my bad on that. Yeah, no, I've, I've been driving for definitely 12 hours, Adam. The truck only goes 50 miles an hour, so it's slow as fuck. So I should be in El Paso. Honestly, Paul, well, look into planning and organizing. It sounds like a lot of work, but it will make your life easier. Get a planner. Write down your ideas and follow through. Here's to a fresh start button. It says Phoenix and 64 miles. Uh, I mean, I planning and organizing. She helps me with that, the planning and organizing for sure. She'll help me a lot. She'll do a good job. And I'll do it too. I think we should pull over and try to fix something on the chair. I think it has to be the chair. But when we stop, it won't speak anymore. So Alright, try to, try to, I think it's like down here. Oh, yes. Here, we're going to check, check it down here. It's gotta be down there. Here, yeah, check it. Stop. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't worry, we'll fix this weekend. gas station will stop so we can try to fix it and so I can get another jewel pod because I would like a jewel pod. Actually not a jewel pod. I have a uh, I have this fucking thing. I have a Soren. The fucking drop like it looks like a raindrop or something. I, I don't know where it is but uh, I bought it and then it stopped working in two hours or like three hours and I was like wow okay like the battery died inside of it and it doesn't charge anymore. And I spent $40 on it. I'm like what a fucking waste of money. Do not buy a Soren drop. It hits really good and it tastes good. And I might give it one more try because it's great. But motherfucker, the battery, it stopped, it broke in three hours. I'm like, what the hell? Like you try to, I try to hit it and it's just flashing red and it doesn't hit. And I leave it in the, plugged into the charger for like an hour and it doesn't even charge. 20K to 3K, wow. What a ride. I never donated to you, man, but I just wanted to say thanks for the laughs. Sad to see it end this way. This is not fun enough for me to stay. I won't be back. CX in the chat. Okay, thank you, dude. Yeah, I mean, I'm driving a car. Sam obviously. literally told Kimberly to lay about him texting her. That's not okay. Has a decent guy, but it wasn't right. By the way, did you get your stuff from the FBI? No, I didn't. Would you do come on stream without showing nude? No, it doesn't matter. 
I did not get myself from the FBI, but they said soon, so whatever that means. Yeah, to the guy I donated earlier, bro, if you are going to come into my stream that says driving the Texas and expect content, I mean, I don't know what you're, I don't know what, what you're expecting. I'm driving. That's your fault for <laughs> expecting something other than driving, I suppose. What? No, it's... Okay. I, I need your advice. Uh, I am Grimoire's top moderator and have fallen in love with her. I spend every waking minute say? moderating her chat in Discord, but she's starting to get annoyed with me. What do I do? Like, of course, I'm driving, and it's not going to be content. Like, it's not about content, dude. It's about fucking chilling. And help, uh, us not be poor as fuck. But... Trap moderator, and I fall in love with her. I, I mean, it sounds like you should just uh, become bisexual, dude. I love her. Her moderator is a trap dog, I think. You're right, I should wear that definitely. It's not that guy's fault for coming in here. But he should, like, like if you read the title, it says driving. What do you expect? gonna be like I'm driving. <laughs>
I agree with that last dude. I think it's boring to watch you now. It's not even half the amount of people as it was before. Maybe you'll be back if you get more viewers, lol. See ya, Ice. Okay, good luck. Um, uh, thank you, KMG. Appreciate it. What was I going to say? Um, I fucking forgot, dude. I've been driving too long. I, 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 Fly looks around to Austin. Good friends are few and far between. Sending positivity your way. Definitely visit San Antonio. Love you, man. Fly Plus looks here to Austin, dude. That's called being a fucking pedo. What are you talking about? I'm not flying a 15. No, he's 15. That would look fucking weird. And then what, he stays on a fucking place? That is so worth I won't crash, don't worry. I'm just kidding. Yeah, we have the, uh, we have all the utilities set up and the internet. Well, actually, not the internet. We have the utilities set up. We still need to set up the internet. And then, yeah, we're good. The internet, uh, I don't think we can actually set it up until we get there to let the internet person in. So, that's kind of annoying. So hopefully the day we arrive, we can get the internet installed that day. That would be great. But I think we arrive. All only real fans are here to watch you. Love you, homie. Yo, thank you, Emilio. Did you say that was the guy who helped us move? Yep, Emilio. Mm -hmm. Are you the guy that helped us move, Emilio? Well, thank you, dude. I was banned and unbanned and banned again. Act weak, he ski, the fuck am I? I mean, it happens, Kimmy. Sorry. Well, I don't know where you can, but thank you. My train thought going away, I've been driving for too long. I was talking about internet. Yeah, I wish somebody could let the internet Well, I'm joining this train of people abandoning you in your streams. I am also done too. The excitement and allure is gone. The cycle has officially ended. You're done, bud. Dead moose meat. See you, weasel. Thank you, dude. Let me check something. I think we're going to arrive on Saturday. I think it's going to take us two and a half days, three days to get there. I think we arrive on Saturday. And we, the internet doesn't send people out on the weekend, so we'd have to wait till Monday for internet. So hopefully not, though. We'll see. I don't fucking know. I'll open up the fiber optic line and do it my fucking self, dude. We should fix this weekend. The, there's a city up here. Look, there's a gas station no, in, in like two miles, so we'll just go to that and I'll see. We'll see how to figure it out. I get a fucking jewel pod. Yes, or something. Every time the trucks drive by, I can feel the trailer swerve uh, because of the wind. And I feel like we're going to die every time a car passes us. But it's fine. It's only 10 o'clock at night. Wow. Dude told me it's been 12 hours since we've been driving. Holy shit. We've gotten how many hours? So many fake fans talking. They're living in the moment and will probably come back when you're settled. The real ones love you and will watch you and support you anyways. THX for streaming. Thank you, Kay. I appreciate that, homie. Yeah, we've been driving for almost 12 hours. And can you map? To see how yeah. many hours we actually are from Austin? Thank you, Kay. I think we've gotten, what, six hours away and 12 hours? <laughs> Six hours away from LA in 12 hours because of how slow we are. Serious question. How does a guy land a real girl like Grimoire? I spend 16 hours a day moderating for her. She is lucky to have me. She calls me a great mod. Do you think I have a chance? I'm serious. 
What the We've built the Reddit Icebiz to this horrible Discord is AIDS and we need more content. We crave content. Get back to your roots. RuneScape. Reddit recaps. That's what we love, Ice. You got this booty. Hope to meet you and TX and have a good chat. Be safe. The trailer makes their break it really fucking hard. Try to slam on it, but be careful, so I don't swerve. Um, if you want to pull Grimoire, just fucking suck her dick. Uh, I'm just kidding, I love her, but I don't know. Fucking move to where she lives and give her money. Imagine hating on someone for 3k viewers when 90% of streamers can't even get 100. Keep doing what you're doing. This is how we get rid of the trash and rebuild. Thank you, homie. I appreciate that, El Paso and Adam. <laughs> Thank you, homie. Okay. That you, I think, I mean, I don't mind it, dude. I mean, if they want to fucking roast. I mean, hey. It's all good. Every roast is $5 worth of diesel, so I'm okay with it. What the fuck was I going to say? I was going to say something, but like I said. Oh, yeah. So, we are only five hours away from L.A. She checked it. We're, fif we're 15 hours away. A normal, if we were in a normal car, it would have, we would be in Texas by now if we were in a normal no, car. Would. Yeah, we would. No, we in 12, you can 12 hours, you can get to El Paso from LA. Really? Yeah. So. Paul, the biggest mistake you made was getting yet. Steve Jobs in the streamer house. Why didn't you choose Jacob? He was always nice and loved by the viewers. I mean, Are Jacob, you really that stupid? I mean, Jacob was with us, dude. What are you talking about? Like, he was with us. <laughs> he made, uh, you know, he was in on it too. Um. Yeah, we're not even the Phoenix yet. We're still like 50 miles from Phoenix. So we've only gotten five hours away from LA in 12 hours. We're never gonna fucking get there, dude. It's gonna take for goddamn ever. <laughs> Someone told me, tell him to lift his goblin butt up to see if it stops when he isn't putting weight on it. The squeak. Oh, all right, I'll try that. Right, I'll be right back, give me two minutes. Two minutes. Why, what are you getting? A jewel bot. No, 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 no. Don't let him be able to entertain them. You don't need, hold it, you don't no. need to. No, okay. listen, I'll keep get, it, keep it. No, I, I'll get you, you don't the know the, food I, I want no, to I'm pick the you, flavor. No, you're not. You're going to get a really good one. I'm no. going to pick it. No, no, no. It's going to be really good. Amberly, no, it's going to be really listen, good. Listen, I would take it inside of me, but I don't know where we are. And if, I if, some, if somebody really finds where we are, no. they can get a shot. CX in the chat. Don't want to die. When I ride through it. Just stay in the car. When I ride through it. I say CX in the chat. Let me see you do that arm thing, baby. Because I want to get my... I want to pick the flavor. I know. Kimberly, 30 seconds. No, I'll call you when I'm in there. No, I want to... I need to see. 30 seconds. Please. Okay. Please. Okay, go. Please, Kimberly. Just go. 30 seconds. gas station doesn't have jewels. Okay. But the one across the street does. The one, the one, no, stop. The one, I'm serious. The one across the street does, she said. You're lying. So I need to be in another 30 seconds. I'll get him. You don't know no. You don't have to be an entertaining. Trust me, Kimberly. Hello, this will be good for you. Here, hide under the blanket. <laughs> no. I'll, I'll be back in a minute, okay? I don't... I don't know. What? Can I go? We'll go together. They're good people. They want to do anything. 
I mean, I'm sure. Come on, we'll take them with. Come what, on. Buy a fucking See, pond? tell them, don't you guys want to come too? Buy a jewel pond? Yep, he, they're, they're about to say it. They want to come. I wasn't paying a dick. I think 3K viewers is you good, guess? especially at this time while you're driving. Has addicted because of the Jap cigarettes. Okay, you're right. Thank you. Okay, Take us with you. See? Yeah, we're good. If anything, uh, if anything happens, Kimberly, just know when you and when you go to my funeral, don't cry. He's so naked. Still two hours? No, we're one hour from Phoenix. One hour, Kimberly. It only takes 13 hours to get to Phoenix when you in a moving truck, bro. That's not bad. All right, so I think this fucking one has the jewel pods. She said. What are you doing? What is all that? It's like a fucking bomb, and you like had to defuse it. Okay. <laughs> Maybe that's why the truck's cheap as shit. Alrighty, let's go then. Do you think my phone fell out? Uh, no. I can call it or something. Will you call it? Actually, I'm streaming. Yeah, try to find it. I'll go in the gas station. Okay. Okay, let's get this shit. Let me put this down. So y'all, uh, well, until I walk inside, I guess. Just one sec. Bro, why does the car have wires? I have no fucking idea. Leave us with Kim. I mean, she, she's too scared. <laughs> She's too scared, man. She's intimidated by the by the stream. I mean, I understand why. Hi. Do you guys have jewels? No. no? Does that one have jewels? I don't know. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay. Let's, uh... Okay, I'm gonna... Fuck. I'm gonna run over to this other gas station and just leave Kimberly by herself in the middle of nowhere at a gas station that probably has thieves, bandits, and highwaymen. That's fine though, it's down the street, dude. It's down the street, dog. Alrighty, I don't wanna like show the outside because like, yeah, I don't know, just just no need to. While uh, I try to get stuff, so. Although I saw, I saw a sign, dude. We're not that. Like we're we're only a, only a couple hours from LA. Like, dude, I'm gonna neck. Realistically, we might get to Texas on like Sunday, or like Monday or something. Like I'm scared that it's gonna take forever to fucking get there. Like I seriously. <laughs> oh man, I thought it was. I thought I could literally get to Texas in one day. I was fucking wrong. I was like, oh, only 21 hours, that's fine. 21 hours will get us to fucking Tucson. Okay. Cigarettes here, or they have the, the vapes here. Oh, they have other, they don't even just have jewels, they have other stuff too. 
That's some good stuff. What is all that? Yeah, they have some like, okay, I'm gonna try some. It says Alto. But they have jewels. They have normal jewels too, so we're just gonna get one of them. Motherfuckers, dude. Actually, I haven't smoked a jewel the entire drive so far, so I don't really need to. I just, I like the flavor. Legacy might help keep me up, too. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, hope Kimberly is not getting kidnapped right now. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Um, can I, uh, what flavors do you have? Is that Alto good? Is that, is that thing good? I've never had it, so I'm not sure. Yeah. Okay, um, can I get the, uh, what are the flavors on the jewel? The flavors on the jewel? I think we have mint, menthol, Virginia, and regular. Okay, I'll just get regular. 3% or 5? Uh, 5. A um, 2-pack or a 4-pack? A 2-pack. <laughs> yeah, what's up, bro? What's up, man? Dude, we're in the uh, we're in the middle of nowhere, dude. I'm so no, I'm not, no, no, no. You're good. I'm saying we're in the middle of nowhere. I'm surprised you you recognize me. Yeah, dude. Because we're in like bumfuck somewhere. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, god damn it. What's your name? Juan. Nice to see you, Juan. Thanks, man. Uh, yeah, just the normal t uh, two packs, fine. That's good. Yeah. So who are you? I don't recognize you. Cocaine man. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm uh, I'm just a, I just make YouTube videos and stuff. Okay. And walk around with the phone. Okay. <laughs> it's that young stuff, John. It's that young stuff. Young stuff that I don't even know. No, there's this guy named Aris Glory and Gold. He's like 80, and he does the same stuff. So it's some old it's old stuff too. Ten. Uh, 62. Okay. Yeah, thanks, homie. All right, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. You have a good day. Thanks. Okay, this, yes. Regular? Oh, wait, I wanted regular. For fucking, I'll smoke Virginia tobacco, dude. <laughs> Virginia tobacco dog. This shit's gross. I I I I wanna I wanna fucking pineapple or something, dude, or fruit punch or something, dude. That fucking Virginia tobacco. Who the fuck smokes this flavor, dude? Why would you wanna get a jewel that tastes like tobacco? Instead of something better like pineapple or crème brûlée or something. I don't know, whatever, dude. Alrighty. No, the, it's not, dude, the FPS is 30 FPS. The quality looks like dog shit. It's dark outside, and the internet, well, the, obviously there's not great internet. We're in the middle of nowhere, so the, the bit rate's really fucking low, but, I mean, you can still see what's going on. Fuck it, dude, it's fine. I mean, is it really? Uh, I'm not addicted to jewels because of the cigarettes from Japan, dude. I'm not addicted to jewels at all. I haven't smoked them in 13 hours. I just like them. So, I'm just like, alright, let's get some. Okay, here we are. Back at the truck. Let me not leak her license plate. But let me show you what I'm actually driving here, in case y'all were wondering. In case y'all didn't see the... Look at this. Fucking car with a trailer. Fucking big 26-foot ass truck. Like, my god, it's fucking huge. Like, it's just, there's just a lot going on here. Don't worry, I'm not gonna scare you, baby. In fact, you're driving now. Am I really? No, just kidding. Okay, I met Juan, he's a nice guy. Seeing you would have never met him. I mean, you're right. Unless he would have known who you were, Kimberly. He would have been like, are you Kimberly? Oh, was he a viewer? So he says. Yes. Yes. 
<laughs> I'm trying to put it back on the thing, but this is what I gotta open it. There you go. Okay, we got it. We got it, baby. Cool. We just. No. Fix, fix me, you stupid fucking idiot. I hate fix me, motherfucker. Alright. Alrighty. There we go. Okay, I'll oh, fuck. I fucked Can you read up. the chat letter there or down there? Uh. I mean, it doesn't really matter. I can read the chat here pretty good. Then it's all got better angles. So. All right. I got some Virginia tobacco jewels. I know how much I love jewels. She hates them because I litter the pods everywhere. Because I'm a fucking bitch. All right. Let's. right. I've actually never had this flavor before. Let's test it out. Let's see how it is. Let's see how this fucking tastes. Is it not working? Wait. Before you leave, go buy one of those car phone holders from the gas station. They only have them at truck stops, not gas stations. Is it fucking dead? Hold on, where's my big battery? Where's it? It's here somewhere. No. Sorry. That was, that was hot. Oh, there we go. I'm just kidding. Alright. Will you charge this for fucking 30 seconds? Because it's fucking dead. And then. Jewel, plug my phone in here. Question for Kim. If you had a mod that gave all his time to you, was super loyal, and changed what? all his interests to your interests, would he have a chance? I've done all of this for Green Noir. Help dude, me. this thing is a weapon, dude. It just came flying at my <laughs> fucking face out of the car holder, dude. What did he say? He said he wants to be a mod of yours if you ever stream. Back in the fucking thing, dude. I think we're good. All right, chat. Is fucking the audio okay? I think we're good. Yeah. All right, hopefully. Let me know, chat. Toxin, homie, if you want to be her mod, if she ever streams, then sure, but don't think she's streaming, homie. <laughs> Alright, let's hit this. Hey, Paul, I'm the retard that donated 60 bucks on accident last month. Can I be your manager now? I will make you $1 million by the end of 2019. Hey, if you donate 60 for real. No, I'm just kidding, but... Yo, this tastes like shit. This tastes like uh, fucking shit. Like, it tastes like a cigarette. Cigarettes taste like shit. You like them in Japan. No, I didn't. I just did what everyone else was doing. I like the, I like the head, like the head rush that you get from nicotine. But I don't like cigarettes. They taste like shit. You know, I, I grew up, uh, well, actually, I grew up not smoking anything. I started vaping, <laughs> I started vaping at 22. Boldest had got me into it. And I was like, wow, nicotine feels good. And then, yeah, so I like, I like vaping. I don't, I don't like cigarettes. They're fucking nasty. It's my fucking seat, I think. I think it is. So how, how do I, do I, fix it? I don't know. I think the seat's just shit. To the last Ono, you can't even manage your own money. You accidentally gave him 60. How are you going to manage his? Also, Paul, go check for a phone holder. Almost all gas stations have it. I 
stopped at like four different gas stations. Only the truck stops have them, I'm promising you. Okay, WD-40. We get WD-40, apparently. I'm not a mechanic. WD-40, we rub it on the entire chair underneath. On like all the metal. Where do we get WD-40? In the, Back in the gas In the station. desert. In the gas Motherfucker, they don't have W. They didn't even have jewel pods. Then they got WD-40? Ask them what they have that would work. Uh, okay. Do they have ma No, they don't. Chat, they have that at probably bus or like truck stops. If the pod isn't working or the light doesn't turn white when you put it in, then the pin's at the bottom of the pod out wards. Also, for a better hit, put our thumb on the plastic part while you hit. Fuck, okay. Or I'll go check. No, I got it. I can go. I got it, I got it. Just putting it this back on the phone is it's hard. Don't worry, this is what well, I'll if do. If they have the phone holder, then you can put that here and you won't even have to put it back. I spent 40, almost $40 on this. Let me see what they have. I mean, I'm, I'm just gonna unscrew it so I don't have to take it out of the, the phone out of it, but I'll unscrew the screw so I can just take this part just off. Just take the whole thing off. Oh, yeah. No, I don't want to lose my spot. So I'll just unscrew this. We're good. There we go. Just like that. All right. Let me, uh, see. W, what the fuck? So WD 40? Is that what? Right? Hey, let me show you something. It what? says online. Uh-huh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Alrighty, WD-40, dude. What is that? That's what Hank Hill fucking says. What is that stuff? I'm just gonna ask if they have shit to, like, not make the chair squeak, I guess. I can't believe I've been driving for so long. That's crazy. Hi. Do you guys have WD-40? Um, if we do, it would be in that first slide. What is that? Like, it makes, it makes like, stuff not squeak? Because, like, my, my chair is really squeaky. Yeah. And I'm trying to, like, make it not squeak. Do you guys have phone holders, too? Have what? Or, like, a phone hold holder? For, like, the, the dashboard or something? No? Well, Okay, that's fine. Okay. Let's see here. We don't have WD-40, but we have lubricant. Lubricant? It's the same thing. So I just put this on my chair? Yeah, where it's squeaking. Like the bolt or something. Chat, does this work? Eliminate squeaks. All right, let's get it. That's what it says. It says that, so fuck it, let's get it. Should I get Kimberly a present? Fucking mom's garden. If I gotta get her fucking pregnant first for that. Uh, have an ass kicking day. That would be a good present. How about this? How about the this? Cause no. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna get her. Actually, we need cups. This is gonna break in the car. Let's be real. I'm gonna get her. I'm a fucking ass. I don't know, dude. I don't, I'm not good at this shit. What do girls like? She says she's uncomfortable. She, I could get her this thing. What if I just get her a hat? <laughs> food? I already got her food, dude. She's not hungry anymore. Alright. I'm gonna get her a beer. No, I'm just kidding. Yes, get her something cute. I do want to drink though, for real though. I want some of this shit. Anti and no, I want sweet tea, bro. I'm not saying. Okay, yeah, I'll get her. I don't have anything cute here. Okay, whatever. Get her ice cream. Oh yeah. Okay, fuck it, dude. She'll like that. Mmm. I mean, everyone likes ice cream. Bro, remember this? What the fuck? Look at this. They have, they have push pops, dude. Dude, I'll get her a push pop, a push up, dude. This, this shit I got in school, dude. Back at high school and sh middle school and shit for like 50 cents. So I'm gonna get her this. She'll like that. Cause like everyone knows what a push up is. This shit's good as fuck. <laughs> for real. Have you ever had a push up? They're good as fuck. 
Yeah, they're amazing, dude. Okay. Five eighty four. Uh, no, it's okay. Thank you. Chat the neck holder. She fucking no. It's a fucking waste. She, it's fine. It's fine. Cause we're not gonna. We're not sleeping in the. We're not gonna sleep. Text outside. from mom. Don't forget the condoms. Winky face. Bro, what are you saying? That's not embarrassing. Like I'm not. I'm not twelve years old, dude. Is it, has, it, has it ever been embarrassing to buy condoms? No, that's what, Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's normal. I mean, um, one time a guy came in and asked if we got extra small ones and got mad because we didn't. What? Extra small? He's like, you know, some people have small dicks. I'm like, hey, my fault. Why would he say that? That's so weird. <laughs> that's what I said. But that was weird. Y'all got extra, extra large though, right? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you. Okay, you can trash that. Thank you. All right. Let's uh, rub this on the squeak. Let's rub this on the squeak, dude. All righty. I hate going to places in the middle of nowhere like this, cause I, cause I always think it's fucking we're gonna die. Yo, what's up, bro? Yeah, I'm streaming right now. What's up, dog? Yeah, what's up? How you doing? Y'all good? How about you? Chilling. What are you uh, doing out here? We just came back from Cali. Hey, me too, bro. Seriously? I know, bro. As you can so see. Weird. Weren't you uh, going to fucking... Uh, Texas. Texas to Cali yeah, stream, right? Yeah, we tried to look up like a live stream. Yeah, we were seeing if you were allowed, but couldn't find you. So I was like, holy... Sh I saw you walk in there. I was like, that's fucking <laughs> ice beside me. What the fuck? What are the odds you see me at a gas station in wherever the fuck we are? Topanga. Like, so, some shit. Sinopa? Yo. Yo, can I take a picture with you? Yeah, let's do it. Is this your... Uh, my fiance. 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 Ah. Yeah. Wow. I'm are you, Dexter. How old are you? I'm 18. I'm about to be 19. Is it married? <laughs> well, not yet. That's you're moving quick. Yeah, we graduated together and everything. So. What are you I'm doing? Already in, out of college. So. What are you doing in Cali? What were I? You already know what I was doing in Cali. You were smoking weed. Yep. <laughs> Isn't it legal here? In Arizona. Yeah. Uh, See where you come from, Colorado too. So what's the difference? Why why drive all the way out there? Fuck okay, it, man. Disneyland. Get high and ride rides, you know? <laughs> Fuck it, yeah, dude. Yeah. Hey, but Arizona, get high and dig holes. This is awesome. <laughs> That's so nuts. There you go. Thank you again, man. I appreciate it. Sorry All good. Be like, no, you're uh, good. I'm just going to rub on some squeaks. That sounds like on the chair. <laughs> All right, man. You have a good night. Appreciate right. it. Later. Y'all are fucked up. Is yeah, dude. Y'all saying some fucked up shit like what sister and shit? Like, nah, come on. What you mean, bro? <laughs> That's my, my drug dealer, Kimberly. I got you. I fucking ice cream, dude. Thank you. That's. Have you ever had a push up? Yeah. They're amazing. Can you do me a favor? Can you get one? No, I got iced tea. I know how much you like, I know how much you like that. Can you do me a favor? Can you hold the phone so I can rub a squeaky shit on my chair? Uh-huh. Okay. Let's see how this works. Oh, I just spray How it. did you know that I would like this? Because I'm a good boyfriend. I saw the ice cream and I was like, you know what? I'm going to get Kimberly. I can't put, can you ice push it up? I can't do it with one get, hand. I'm gonna get Kimberly ice cream. Look at your shit. That's so nice. Yeah. I mean, what can I say? You know, I was either gonna get you the, uh, the ice cream or the neck pillow. <laughs> I like this more. I know, I knew it. I fucking knew it. <sighs> and the chat was like, don't get her ice cream. And I was like, nah, I'm gonna get her ass ice cream. What the fuck is this thing? Okay, fuck it. So I just, I'll just spray all over, I guess. They're saying lies. Kimberly, I have been analyzing your personality for the past hour. Just know that I am always watching you. Every move you make, you can't see me. I can see you. <laughs> Always remember this. You can't hide. That's so scary. You're, okay. They said get the ice cream. Really? 
I you want, are such a liar. I wanted to get yeah. you a fucking... Your uh, viewers know me more than you. I chose to push Put the rest straw in the hole and spray on spot. <laughs> yeah, well, I just sprayed the whole chair. Um, oh, it smells like shit now. Um, You're a liar. I, I chose to push up. And I, I was, I was going to get you either, well, a thing that I said, can't believe you would lie to me. I was going to get you a thing that said. You would lie to me and said, just be okay with it. I was going to get you something that said mom's garden. <laughs> like a fucking pad or something, but. You were going to give me a pad? Like a fucking, for like a water or something? <laughs> like for a counter? Oh, like a coaster? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, this shit doesn't work. I just sprayed this whole chair. And it's, I, I can't, it smells like shit now. Like, I feel like I'm going to suffocate from the fumes. I would have never known if I didn't read chat oh. and hear them say last. We're good. I think we're good. Let's try it. I'll take it. No, I like holding it up. Chat, so you have to tell me if you see something. Ah! Oh no. Uh oh. Just press the down arrow to your right. Oh. There we go. Oh, you're so smart. What can I say? It smells like the fucking country in here now. It smells like fucking. It smells bad. Like, like shit. It smells like, it smells like a gas or WD 40. Let's, uh, are we actually gonna get, like, brain- Yeah, Kim, I'm gonna have to ask you to respect I and K. Respect what? Respect me. I guess, oh. I think. I hope we don't get brain damage from breathing this shit in. <laughs> it's so squeaking. I, I, I don't want to say anymore. It's not fair after the work you put into long-distance relationship and him cheating with gas. He goes and kills his career. Try to meet Mize Keefe and trade up to a big streamer for more Gucci bag. What? She doesn't care about that, dude. She cares about my fucking unconditional love I give her. I love you. And you know what? That's how it's gonna be. Well, didn't, didn't it also say that you cheated on me, but you didn't cheat on me. They always say I cheat on you. I don't know why. You sprayed something wrong. I know, it smells awful. Like, <laughs> I think we're at, I need to roll the window down. We're gonna get brain damage. <laughs> I already have that, so I don't need any more. And I didn't even charge my jewel enough, so I have to just wait and charge it. If I can smoke it, dude. You're at 16%. Fuck, alright, here. Can you plug this in? Yeah. Oh, fuck, shit. God. From Phoenix, baby. We are getting there. We're almost a quarter of the way there. Isn't that great? I mean, Gary said he drove from Rhode Island to LA. Kim, listen. Paul's first thought when he got in the station was to get you something. That shows he cares about you. He loves you. Give him a kiss. I love him too. It took Gary six days to get to LA from Rhode, Rhode Island, so like it shouldn't take us more than three days to get to Texas. Like I don't think I don't want to just stream driving every day for three days, but I also don't want to stream in like a city. I just want to get there. Like I don't want to waste time. Like I don't want to have all our shit like parked in a parking lot. Like a stream like this retarded. I haven't had one of these since I was a kid. It says the connection device is unable to connect to the USB. Yeah, it just ignore that. Okay, but that means it's not going to charge, right? No, it's still charging. It says uh, the charge oh. symbol, right? From the top? Uh, yeah, it actually does. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know how much longer we should go for, though. Like, driving-wise, like, I want to keep going, but... The problem is, if let's say I get tired at, like, 4 a.m., 
like, I need to sleep at 4 a.m. If we check into a hotel at 4 a.m., they're going to force us to check out at 11. That is not enough sleep. I need more. I see you didn't understand my last dono. I'm seriously falling in love with Grimoire and need the community's help to get her to fall in love with me too. How do I convince her I'm the perfect man? Who do you say he's falling in love with you? No, Grimoire. Oh. Dude, all you have to do is fly out there, find her, and be like, into tall ass girls. Like, she's tall. She's six feet tall. If you say, I'm into that shit, she'll just get with you. I think. I mean, I assume. You know, you just gotta think the way, like Grimoire. Like, what is Grimoire like? I don't really know her that well, so I can't really tell you, but... You know, buy her like a stuffed animal or something and you're good. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Bro, that shit just fell under the seat, dude. With a with WD-40 all over it. Ken, what plans do you have for yourself in Texas? That's fine. That's fine. Good thing I have another jewel. A what? backup jewel. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, dude, I actually, uh, I come prepared so The point of this straw on the can is to precisely spray all the bolts and springs. Okay. All you did was spray it all over the place like it's a Febreze SMH. Did you hear him? What did he say? Something? Uh, I didn't hear him either. How do I check what he said? Like the bell on the top, right? Okay. I wasn't listening. What was it? He said, the point of the sh- Wait, it's really shaky. Here you go. This is safe. <laughs> The point of the straw on the can is to spray the bolts and springs. All oh. you did was spray all over the you place. You sprayed all around. Fuck. You didn't really... Well, it's not really squeaking that much, is it? How do I get out of this? Swipe to the right. Okay. And then somebody asked me what I'm going to do in, in Texas. Um, I'm going to get a job. I think I'm also going to go back to school. I told her don't go back to school. I want to. I think she should just uh, live with me and do nothing. No, but I want to go to school. Maybe I'll go to school with you. Go to school together. I mean, I don't know why you're smiling. <laughs> like, we're taking different majors, so maybe that's we're not going to be in the same class. But Yeah. Dude, I would love to go back to school and just fucking do nothing. I don't know, it's fun to like still get a degree, but do nothing. Like only do the tests and don't study. It's fun. I can't hit this, I don't know why. I'm only gonna charge it long enough. I'm pissed. Let me try this one. There we go. This one's kinda harsh, I don't know why, but it's a lot better. This one doesn't hit well at all. I don't like this one. I think it's broken. It doesn't hit at all. Like, it's so hard to hit. And that one, like, it tastes like Ford, like, fucking spray shit now. I hope I'm not inhaling, like, WD-40. Use your streamer cloud to get into Austin City Limits for Savage. We'll be there. Check the lineup. Hey, Kim. You are the cutest thing I've seen. I want to give you belly and chat. She is cute. I don't know. I don't think you can just. Kim, please think clearly. Get into a school. Vilda left Paul. He waited till the last minute to give an excuse. Vilda is Paul's closest friend, and he gave up this life because it's not worth. Take the hint. Evicted soon. What a bigger squeaker, Kim, or the truck just messing with you, Kim. Hard. Vilda said to not give up the life. Getting evicted sucks, but like, this is a very unique way to live, and I, I don't think most people would give it up, man. Like, it's fun. Like, it's a fun way to live. Sometimes, like, usually. Sometimes it's not, but usually it is. Like, even, I mean, how many of you guys in the chat would live with me? Free rent aside, how many of you would live with me? 
it's it's it, tell me what they say. I mean, it's it's interesting. Even if we get a someone said me, someone said nah. Nope, me. Kimberly, no. I would eat your boogers and your butthole. No, they. I say booger booger. Hell no, no, nah. Me, nope. Okay, what if what if you got to live with me for free? Then would you? Like, I'm down. Like, think about it like this. Me need life. I no. pay. I pay for no. movers 95 percent of the time instead of us doing it ourselves so moving's not an issue like that's easy you know they, they do all the work we that just... person said i'd live with you and give you content <laughs> that's what they all say like i don't i think moving is kind of fun you get to live in a new place every couple months and that's fun you get to set up like i like setting up the house, it's fun. So, uh, but I don't want to do that anymore. I just want to stay in this one place for next year. So, why do they keep talking about boogers? EBZ ate his boogers. That's why. On I don't stream? Know. Yeah, on stream. He's like eating boogers. Yeah. He said it's not boogers. He said he just like ditched his nose or something, but it was boogers. Like, of course it was. Like I said, EBZ comes from a place that's very famished. So it's like, you gotta eat what you can get. So, you know, like I would eat my fucking finger if I had to. Yeah, like I said, what do you think? Should I, should I drive until 4 a.m.? Or... Kim, I would drink your bath water. Should I? Should I? What? Yeah, oh, I mean, you can if you want. Should we drive until 4 a.m.? Or... I get into a hotel sooner because, like I said, if they make us check out at 11 o'clock in the morning, we're not going to get any sleep. I work at a survey place and have to ask people for their race. People get so upset when you ask them, ma'am, what is your race? Now how the hell is you going to ask me, dad? Okay, so we're African American. I mean, you can just say what's your ethnicity. There's nothing offensive about that. If they're hopefully proud of who they are. It's so hard to hold it, like, kind of not bumpy. That's fine. You hold it stationary. What did the chat say? Is it? Is there a way to stay in a hotel past 11? Um, someone said drive until 4 p.m. Duh. I don't know. I can't really see. I can only see, like, three comments at a time. Someone said no. Someone said hotel. I don't know. Because I know if I'm tired as fuck tomorrow, like, that's dangerous. <laughs> like, I don't want to... I don't want to be, like, if we're driving 12 hours a day, I don't want to be tired. That would suck. But then again, I've never really driven long distances. So last Someone said yes. Kimberly asked for a late checkout. I mean, late checkouts are usually, like, 12. Or, like, like right? LOL is already regretting moving to Texas. He knows it's a bad idea, but doesn't have enough humility to admit to ID LOL. I see you know it's true. Have some humility, please. Also, can the blues one. Oh, yay! Why is moving to Texas a bad idea? If it was a bad idea, I, I wouldn't move there. <laughs> that donator must have been from St. Louis. Why? They said something. What they said about it? Yeah, the blues one. Hockey. Oh, this jewel's not working. I don't know why. Rip. My... God damn it, man. Fuck. Where's my fucking soaring work? Maybe when we get to Phoenix, I, we will stop at a hotel then. Because, yeah, I mean, I'm already, like, I'm kind of getting tired now, and late checkout is, like, not that late. It's, like, 12 or 1. I don't know. We'll see, dude. tubing down the Guadalupe River in New Braunfels. It's like you can even float a cooler full of beer and look with you. Look it up. 
said cantaloupe is the worst word ever, but it's fucking, it tastes good. It doesn't taste like really anything. It tastes like water. It's good for you. I don't know. Ask what chat thinks. Someone said it is slimy.
wasn't working, hence I wasted $5. Please go on YouTube and play out loud Sweet Little Kevin. It is by a channel called The Minute Hour. It is very short. Thank you. Drive not a lower gear. Call Pinsky if you can't fix it, they can help. I mean, it does go faster than 50, but when I go faster than 50, it starts shaking and swerving and doing shit that I don't feel comfortable with. Alright, this is a great song, I guess. Uh, sorry, the media's not working on me. I don't want to listen to I mean, I would listen to that, but. For how long, though? I literally drove seven hours from Vegas to LA in this thing with no music by myself, no talking, silence for seven hours, because it lets me concentrate on the road. I don't like listening to stuff when I drive. I, I mean, I will for the stream, but you know what I mean. Um, yeah, when I go 55 or 60, this thing, I feel like I'm going to die driving this truck. <laughs> like, it's just so fucking shaky as an engine. I got to make sure I don't run out of death. I don't even know what that means, but somebody said don't run out. But it's like basically full. I think it takes a long, long time to run out of that shit. Oh, what does death do? I don't even know. It's not basically full. Death? Yeah, we were told that it was like almost empty. Uh, yeah, look, it says there's a thing right here that says oh, really? that it's full completely. When he checked it, he said it wasn't. This is the same person that. Kimberly, yeah. is your vagina in an E or an LT? Also, do you like your toes being sucked? P.S. Can you mail me your boogers? She's a virgin, bro. She, there, there's no uh, toe sucking there. Rip everyone. Yep, fuck it. Everyone's dead. Joe Rogan, BBC. Everyone's dead. Oh, no, you're right. That's what happens. The world's a dangerous place. Oh, it's 11.30. 
11 o'clock right now. I've been driving since 11.30. It's been about, about 12 hours, like almost 12 hours of driving, so pretty nutty. We've only filled up the gas once, so pretty, pretty much been driving straight through the whole time, except when I took a shower for fucking 20 minutes. Come drive to Philly. Bro, drive to Philadelphia? What? No, what? In this thing? No. No, I don't like furniture, dude. Show the road. I mean, the, the road, there's not anything to see on the road, I'm telling you. And people said to show the road. Fuck, fuck. Babe, babe, babe. I can't see. Lights are off. The lights are off. What? How do you turn them on? No, I don't know. I right, let me turn on this. Turn on okay. the fucking here. Show. Here, 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 get over the corner. Yeah, show me. Okay, okay. Here, I'm, I'm using the blinker. Pull over. Pull over, though. I can't. Fuck. All right, I'm pulling over. Oh, my God. The car just shut off. The, the wheel's not moving now. The wheel's not moving. The fuck just happened? Okay. I'm using the blinker so I can fucking see. Because everything shut off. Yo, that was smart of me, though. Look at this. The blinker so I can see the road when everything turned off. Why did that just turn off? Every, the power just shut off in the car. Every, the, the car literally just shut the fuck off. What the fuck just happened? What did you do? I don't know. Nothing. I don't know. I don't fucking know. I just turned it back on. I literally was driving and the headlights turn off. They won't turn back on. <laughs> And then the car stops working, like the gas, the brake, everything. Well, not Will the brake. Chat what happened? If they know, like if. Chat, why'd that happen? I think. Okay, I think I know what happened. Because when the phone fell over, I think. I think. The key? I think it turned the key when the phone fell off the thing. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. Let me just get more. That's scared, dude. That's holy fuck. Holy shit, dude. Let me just get compose myself one sec. <laughs> Let me just compose myself, dude. Can you turn the wipers off? Yeah, hold on. I was, like, panicking to try to turn the headlight on. That's why these are on. How the fuck do I turn this on? Alright. <sighs> yeah, I'm pretty sure the phone turned the key when I when it fell. Yo, that was so fucking scary. I literally panicked. I literally, I, bro, pulling a trailer in this big truck and then the gas doesn't work, the fucking steering wheel locks, and then the headlights turn off and I can't see. I literally, if there was a, if there was cars around us, we might have actually died. <laughs> because, I mean, lucky there was no cars around us, but that was so fucking scary. If we would have crashed, all of our, our whole lives would be fucked. All of our shit would be fucked. Your car would be fucked. <laughs> about the car like I hope we would be okay oh we would be fine like this is a big ass car what are we gonna go off the road into the ditch like I don't know no we're good okay yo was I smart or what chat though putting on the hazard lights to to see the fucking the road and it was dark I think I'm a genius I, I work well under pressure don't I okay um let's let's drive again put the phone somewhere where it's not gonna fall and hit the goddamn key. But how did that, it, what the fuck? Why does the key let you turn it when you're driving? <laughs> like, as you're driving. Fuck, shit, I hate, bro, I'm gonna call this company and say you almost killed us. <laughs> fucking phone fucking holder, dude. That scared the fuck out of me, though. What did you think? I don't know. I didn't really say anything. I didn't know, like... You were just like, what's going on? I, I mean, I was almost asleep. Okay, we're good. Nah, I used to be a line cook, babe. When something happens, I work well under pressure. I wouldn't let us die, don't worry. If it wasn't for these... If, if I didn't think about turning the blinkers on, we might... Yeah, like he said, babe, babe, the light just turned off. Like, I didn't know what that meant. Like, I didn't know that... I don't know. I just... 
I'm just saying, chat, if I didn't turn the blinkers on. I know, to you're, be able you're to, a genius to who be, saved our lives. To be I'm able to so see. Glad. I'm, I'm serious. If I didn't turn the blinkers on to see the road, I would have been in the ditch or fucking in a car's hood. I'm, I'm, I'm glad. I'm a fucking genius. I used to be a line cook. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> I think anyone else in my position would have died. <laughs> I literally saved our lives. They should put me in the next Avengers movie. Someone said blinker genius. <laughs> I'm pissed. I'm not pissed. I was just, I was just scared. <laughs> Penske's scuffed. Bro, Penske's gonna kill us. Nah, that was my fault with the, with the key. Bro, I'm serious though. If there was traffic around us, we'd be dead right now. I'm just kidding, shut up, obviously. Huge ego. No, I'm just... Are you two retards actually driving without your seat belts on? You're beyond retarded, Paul. Then you wonder why everyone thinks you're as dumb as you look. Bro, it's, I'm literally wearing it. What are you saying? Alright, let's fucking drive. I was laying down with my seatbelt on. Clip this. 
say I'm drunk. Look at him driving drunk. He said he can't even say his words. What did you say to Sam? I said, mixed up. I mean, you're not. I'm not drunk. You should clarify, yeah, you should clarify that. I am definitely not drunk. I am obviously sober. I mean, obviously. <laughs> but I'm just saying, someone would, I uh, I'm just tired a little bit. If I was on meth, my words would never get messed up. I'd be Superman, dude. There's a dude on the side of the road with a cop. Right, I hope this is Phoenix up here, those lights down there. I fucking hope so. Meth can keep you awake, but not in a good way. I like sleeping too. Meth would make me, or keep me from sleeping. I don't know 
how these semi trucks are going like seven. I don't know how the semis are going 70 miles an hour. I don't. Like, their fucking trucks weigh way more than my truck. I'm assuming that semi trucks have better engines because they're bigger. But, I mean, it's not really the end. Like, this thing can go up to 70. I just am scared. Like, it starts to really get, it feels fucking, un it feels weird. Like, it swerves and shit and, like, shakes. Like, I get scared driving this shit at 60. Um, but, 70. Before, before you start a stream tomorrow, we need a phone holder, and not this thing. Yeah, I need to get a, a more flexible, better phone holder. I'll do that. I'll get one. I know CX News, uh, or IRL News, got, uh, Burger Planet strike it. Ain't that some shit. You know, after uh, the whole falling out with Burger Planet, I deleted every VOD. Actually, yeah, I just looked through a lot of VODs that had me watching his stream on it. Because, like, I didn't want to deal with any of that shit. Any Burger Planet copyright. I mean, I guess I'll say it's not a, it's not a thing that it doesn't W, down. Kim, stop talking. You're killing my be one -er. You're fine. Um, Modafinil doesn't get you high, nor, it could be, I mean, anything could be addictive, but it doesn't get you high. Like, it's not like, it's not Adderall, you know, so... I don't think anyone who takes Modafinil is a drug addict. Like, the military fucking... You're like person. five minutes from my house. Come stay. Uh, we'll just get a hotel. I mean, we could stay at people's houses, but... I, I don't know, that's putting a lot of trust. We have literally all of our stuff with us. It's putting a lot of trust in that person. But, um... Yeah, the military takes Modafinil and, like, Air Force pilots and... University professors stuff, so, it really, uh, it's not even like that, I 
Okay, well, I don't depend on motherfucking ass modafinil, dude. I don't really take it. Like, I took it, obviously, today, so I can drive this long-ass time, but that was it.
later guys